Blessed is our God, only Son, and Son the ages of ages. Amen. Glory to you, Christ, our God, of hope, glory to you. Heavenly King, who comfort the spirit of truth, who are ever present in false all things, the treasure of every star of life, come and dwell in us, and cleanse us of every stain, and see where souls are good one. Peace be light, is what all. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. All holy trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, be gracious unto our sins. Master, pardon our iniquities. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, which art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For that is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Now and ever unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father. Glory to the holy, consubstantial, life-creating, and indivisible Trinity, always, now, and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Glory to God in the highest, and earth, peace, good will towards men. Glory to God in the highest, and earth, peace, good will towards men. Glory to God in the highest, and earth, peace, good will towards men. O Lord, thou shalt open my lips, and most shall declare thy praise. O Lord, thou shalt open my lips, and my mouth shall declare thy praise. O Lord, why are they multiplied that afflict me? Many rise up against me, many saints to my soul. There's no salvation for him and his God. But thou, O Lord, at my help and my glory, and lift up my head, I cried unto the Lord of my voice. He heard me out of his holy mountain. I laid me down and stepped. I woke for the Lord to help me. I will not be afraid of ten thousand people that set themselves against me round about. Arise, O Lord, save me, O my God, for thou hast me now with all cause of my enemies. The teeth of sinners are still broken. Salvation is of the Lord, and blessing is upon thy people. I laid me down and slept. I woke for the Lord to help me. O Lord, rebuke me not in that anger, nor chase me in the wrath, for thine errors are fast me. Thou hast laid thy hand heavily upon me. There is no healing of my flesh in the face of thy wrath. There is no peace in my bones in the face of my sins. <coughs> for mine enemies, <coughs> for mine iniquities have risen higher than my head, as every burden have they pressed heavily upon me. My bruises have become noise and corrupt in the face of my folly. I have been wretched and utterly bowed down to the end all the day long. I went with downcast face. For my loins are filled with mockings, so there is no healing of my flesh. I am afflicted and humble exceedingly, and roared from the groaning of my heart. The Lord before thee is all my desire, my groaning is not hid from thee, my heart is troubled, my strength hath failed me, and light of my eyes, even this is not with me. My friends and my neighbors are nigh against me, and stood, and my nearest of kin stood afar off. And they that set off to my soul use violence, and they that sought evil to me speak vain things, and craftiness is all the day long do they meditate. But as for me, like a deaf man, I heard them not, I was as a speechless man that opened not his mouth, and became as a man that heareth not, that hath his mouth no reproofs. For in thee have hoped, O Lord, thou wilt hearken unto me, O Lord my God. For I said, Let never my enemies rejoice over me. Yea, when my feet were shaken, those men speak boastful words against me. For I am ready for scourges, and my sorrows continue before me. For I'll declare my iniquity, I'll take heed concerning my sin. <coughs> but my enemies live in me, strong in the nine. They that hate me, unjustly are multiplied. They that are enemy, evil for good, slander me because of pursued goodness. Forsake me not, O Lord my God, depart not, from, <coughs> depart not from me. Be attentive unto my help, O Lord, of my salvation. Forsake me not, O Lord, my God, depart not from me. Be attentive unto my help, O Lord, of my salvation. O God, my God, unto thee are early at dawn. My soul hath thirsted for thee. How often hath my flesh longed after thee, and I land barren and untrodden and unwatered. So in the sanctuary have I appeared before thee to see thy power and the glory for thy mercies. But in lies my lips shall praise thee. So shall I bless thee, my life, and in the name will lift up my hands as with merry and fatless. My soul be filled with lips of rejoicing. Shall my mouth praise thee. <coughs> If I remember thee on my bed at the dawn, I meditated on thee, for thou become my help, and the shelter of thy wings where I rejoice, my soul hath cleaved after thee. Thy right hand is going to help me, but as for these of vain, if they set off to my soul, they should go into the most parts of the earth. They should be surrounded to the edge of the sword portions, for foxes shall they be, but the king shall be glad in God, and one shall be praised and swear by him, for the mouth of them is stopped, that speak unjust things. At the dawn I meditated on thee, for thou become my help, and the shelter of thy wings where I rejoice, my soul hath cleaved after thee, the right hand is going to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, put down over to the ages of ages, amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to your God, alleluia, 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 glory to your God, alleluia, 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 glory to your God, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, put down over to the ages of ages, amen. <laughs> o Lord God, of my salvation, my day, God, I've been before them, and prayer, come before thee, bow down the to my supplication. 
fulfill the thieves of my soul, my life and the age, I draw nigh. I am count with them a Quran to the pit, and become as a man with an out for you among the dead, like the bodies of the slain, the seep and grave, from their members, the more they are cut off from the hand. They lay in the lowest pit in darkness, and the shadow of death against me is an anger made strong, and all the abilities are separate upon me. Thou hast removed, thou hast removed my friends afar from me, the maven of abomination unto themselves. I have been delivered up, and have not come forth. My eyes are going from poverty. I have cried unto thee, O Lord, the whole day long. I have stretched out my hands unto thee. Nay, for the dead, with our wonder, shall physicians raise them up, that they may give thanks unto thee. Nay, shall any in the grave tell of thy mercy, and of thy truth, and thy destruction. Nay, shall the one that is been known in that darkness, and the righteousness in that land that is forgotten. But as for me unto thee, O Lord, I have a cry, and in the morning shall my prayer come before thee. Wherefore, Lord, as I cast off my soul, and turns thy face away from me. A poor man of mine, in troubles from my youth, yea, having been exalted, I was humbled and brought to distress. Thy furies have passed upon me, that there is a solely trouble me. They came round about me like water all day long. They come to me about together. Thou hast removed afar from offended and even run acquaintances because of my misery. O Lord God of my salvation, but they were caught up by night before them. My prayer come before thee, but down there into my supplication. Bless the Lord of my soul and all that is with me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord of my soul and forget not all that he hath done for thee. <coughs> Who is gracious unto all that iniquities are healed, all their infirmities redeemeth thy life from corruption and crowneth thee with mercy and compassion. Who fulfilleth thy desire with good things, that you shall be renewed as the eagles. The Lord performeth these in mercy and execute a judgment for all them that are wronged. He that made his ways known unto Moses, unto the sons of Israel, the things that he hath willed, compassionate and merciful is the Lord, long suffering and abundance of mercy, not unto the end will he be angry, neither unto eternity will he be wroth. Not according to our iniquities of the devil, with us neither according to our sins, hath he rewarded us, for according to the height of heaven from the earth, the Lord hath made his mercy prevail over them, I fear him as far as these from the west, so far hath he removed our iniquities from us. <coughs> Like as a father hath compassion upon his son, so hath the Lord compassion upon them, and fear him, for he knoweth whereof we are made. He hath remembered that we are dust. As for man, his days are as the grass, as the flower of the field, so shall he blossom forth. For when the wind is passed over, then it shall be gone no longer will another place thereof. But the mercy of the Lord is from eternity, when unto eternity upon them, and fear him, and his righteousness is upon the sons of sons, upon them, and give his testament to remember his commandments to do them. The Lord in heaven hath prepared his throne, and his kingdom ruleth over all. Bless the Lord, his angels, mighty and strength, to perform his word, to the voice of his words. Bless the Lord, his hosts, and ministers, and do his will. Bless the Lord, his works, every place for his dominion. Bless the Lord, of my soul, and every place for his dominion. Bless the Lord, of my soul. O Lord, hear my prayer, give merit to my supplication, thy truth, hearken unto me, and the righteousness, and enter not into judgment with thy servant, from thy sight shall no man live be justified. For the enemy hath persecuted my soul, he hath my life down to the earth, he has sought me in darkness as those that belong there, and my spirit has become the spawn with him, my heart is shoveled. I remember days of old, I meditated on all the works upon the creations of the hands, which stretched with my hands unto thee, my soul thirsted up to thee like a waterless land. <coughs> Quickly hear me, O Lord, my spirit hath fainted away. <coughs> Turn out the face away from me, lest I will come to them and go down into the pit. Cause me thy mercy in the morning, for thee have I put my hope. Cause to know, Lord, the way when I shall walk, for unto thee have I lifted up my soul. Rescue me from my enemies, O Lord, unto thee, where I forever which teach me to do thy will, for thou art my God. Thy good spirit shall lead me in the land of uprightness, for thy name's sake, O Lord, shall thou quicken me, and thy righteousness shall open my soul, the affliction. And in thy mercy shall thou utterly destroy my enemies, and thou shalt go to follow them, and afflict my soul from thy servant. Hearken unto me, O Lord, in thy righteousness, and do not in judgment of thy servant. Hearken unto me, O Lord, in thy righteousness, and do not in judgment of thy servant. Thy good spirit shall lead me in the land of uprightness. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, put none of to the age of age of men. Hallelujah, 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 glory to you, God. Hallelujah, 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 glory to you, God. Hallelujah, 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 glory to you, God. I hope the Lord, glory be to thee. In peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for the peace from above and the salvation of our souls, let us pray Lord to the Lord. Mercy. For the peace of the whole world, the good estate of the holy churches of God, and the union of all, let us pray Lord to the Lord. Lord. For this holy house, for them that with faith, reverence, and fear of God enter here, and let us pray Lord to the Lord. Mercy. Our Father and Archbishop Demetrius, Lord have mercy. And his son, dear, for the venerable presbytery, the diaconate in Christ, for all the clergy and the people, let us pray Lord to the Lord. Lord. Mercy. For this sacred monastery, this town, for every city, town, and countryside, and the faithful that dwell therein, let us pray Lord to the Lord. For seasonable weather, abundance of the fruits of the earth, and peaceful times, so let us pray Lord to the Lord. Lord. For them that travel by sea, land, and air, for the sick, the afflicted, for captives, and their salvation, let us pray Lord to the Lord. Lord. For our deliverance from all tribulation, wrath, danger, and necessity, let us pray Lord to the Lord. Lord. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy Lord grace. Mercy. Calling to remembrance for all holy, immaculate, most Lord blessed, Lord glorious, city, the virgin Mary, to all the saints, let us commit ourselves to one another in all our life unto Christ our to God. The Lord. For unto thee is to all glory, honor, and worship to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Amen.
cloud of the night. My spirit waketh at dawn unto thee, O God, for thy commandments are a light upon the earth. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. The righteousness ye that dwell upon the earth. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Zeal shall lay hold upon an uninstructed people, and now fire shall devour the adversaries. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Add more evils upon them, O Lord, add more evils upon them that are glorious upon the earth. <coughs> alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Lifting our hearts to heaven, let us imitate the angelic order, and with fear let us fall down before the impartial judge while crying out the triumphant phrase, Holy, holy, holy art thou, O God, through the protection of the bodiless host, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. The cherubim dare not gaze upon thee, but as they fly about, they shout with jubilation the divine song of the thrice holy hymn. Together with them we sinners also cry, Holy, holy, holy art thou, o God, through the intercessions of the hierarch, have mercy on us. Holy, now and ever and unto the ages of ages, amen. Bow down under the multitude of our transgressions, and not daring to look up to thy height, we bow soul and body, while with the angels we cry to thee the hymn. Holy, holy, holy art thou, O God, through the Theotokos, have mercy on us. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, for now and ever unto the ages of ages, amen. And to thee, O Lord, have I lifted up my soul, O my God, and to thee, have I trusted, let me never be put to shame, nor let my enemies not be to scorn, yea, let none that wait on thee be put to shame, nor to be ashamed, which are lawless without a cause. Make thy ways, O Lord, known unto me, and teach me thy paths, lead me in thy truth, and teach me, for thou art God my Savior, for in thee have I waited all the day long. Remember thy compassions, O Lord, thy mercies, for they are from everlasting. The sins of my youth and my ignorance is, remember not a word, and give thy mercy, remember thou me, for the sake of thy goodness, O Lord, good and upright is the Lord, therefore will he set a law for them, and send away. He will guide them, make in judgment, he will teach and make his ways, all the ways of the Lord are mercy and truth, unto them that seek a thirst, covenants, testimonies, for the sake of the name, O Lord, be gracious unto my sin, for it is great. Who is man that feareth the Lord, he will set him along the way which he hath chosen, his soul shall dwell among good things, and his each shall inherit the earth. The Lord is the strength of them that fear him, and his covenant shall be manifested unto them. Mine eyes are ever toward the Lord, for he it is. O draw my feet out of the snare. Look upon me, and have mercy me, for I am one, only begotten and poor. The afflictions of my heart are multiplied. Bring me out from my necessities. Behold my lowliness, my toil, and forgive all my sins. Look upon my enemies, for they are multiplied, and with an under hatred they hated me. Keep my soul and rescue me. Let me not be put to shame, for I have hoped in thee. The innocent of the upright have cleaved unto me, for I have waited on thee, O Lord. Redeem Israel, O God, out of all his afflictions. Judge me, O Lord, for in mine innocence have I walked, and hoping in the Lord I shall not grow weak. Prove me, O Lord, and try me. Prove me with fire my reins and my heart, for the mercies before mine eyes, and I have been well pleasing in thy truth. I have not sat with the counsel of vanity, nor shall I go in with them that transgress the law. I have hated the congregation of evildoers, and with the ungodly when I not sit, I will wash my hands in innocence. I will come to sign unto our Lord, that I may hear the voice of thy praise, and tell of all thy wondrous works. O Lord, I have loved the beauty of thy house, and place where thy glory dwelleth. Destroy not my soul with the ungodly, nor my life with men and blood, in whose hands are iniquities, their right hand is full of bribes. But as for me, in my innocence have I walked, redeem me, O Lord, and have mercy in me. My foot has stood in uprightness in the congregations, but I bless thee, O Lord. The Lord is my light and my Savior, whom then shall I fear. The Lord is the defender of my life, of whom then shall I be afraid, when a wicked draw an eye against me. To eat my flesh, and they that afflict me, and are mine enemies, they themselves became weak, and they fell. Though a host should array itself against me, my heart shall not be afraid. Though war should rise up against me, and this if I hope one thing, have I asked of the Lord, this will I seek out there, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, and that I may behold the delight of the Lord, and that I may visit his holy temple, for he hid me in his tabernacles in a day of my troubles. He shelter me in the secret place of his tabernacle upon a rock, where he exalted me, and now behold, he exalted my head above mine enemies, and went round about, and I sacrifice in his tabernacle, a sacrifice of praise and jubilation. I will sing, and I will chant unto the Lord, hearken, O Lord, unto my voice, wherewith I have cried. Have mercy on me, and hearken unto me, my Heart said unto thee, I will seek the Lord my face, and sought after thee thy face, O Lord, will I seek, turn not thy face from me, and turn not away in wrath from thy servant. Be thou my helper, cast me not utterly away, and forsake me not, O God, my Saviour. 
For my father and my mother have forsaken me, but the Lord have taken me to himself. Set me in law, Lord, in my way, and lead me in the right path because of mine enemies. Deliver me not over unto the souls of them that afflict me, for unjust witnesses have risen up against me, and and injustice have led to itself. I believe that I will, shall see the good things of the Lord in the land, and the living way of the Lord, and be thou men full. And let thy heart be strengthened, and wait on the Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Both now and over unto the ages of ages of men, unto thee, O Lord, will I cry, O my God, be not silent unto me, lest if thou be silent to me, I'll become like them that go down into the pit. Hearken, O Lord, unto my supplication when I pray unto thee, when I lift up my hands towards thy holy temple. Draw me not in with sinners, with the workers of unrighteousness. Destroy me not who speak peace with their neighbors, but evils, uh, but evils are in their hearts. Give unto them, O Lord, according to their deeds, and according to the wickedness of their endeavors, according to the work of their hands. Give unto them, render their reward unto them. For they have not understood the works of the Lord, and the works of his hands. I shall destroy them, and shall not build them up. Blessed is the Lord, because he hath heard the voice of my supplication. The Lord is my helper and my defender. My heart hath hoped in him, and I am helped in my flesh, if flourished again, and out of my desire will I confess him. The Lord is the strength of his people, and the champion of salvation for his anointed one. Save thy people, and bless thine inheritance. Shepherd them, and bear them up into eternity. Bring unto the Lord, ye sons of God. Bring unto the Lord, ye sons of Ram. Bring unto the Lord glory and honor. Bring unto the Lord glory and honor, and glory due unto his name. Worship the Lord in his holy court. The voice of the Lord is upon the waters. The God of glory hath thunder. The Lord is upon the many waters. The voice of the Lord of might. The voice of the Lord of majesty. The voice of the Lord who breaketh the cedars. Cedars, yea, the Lord will break the cedars of Lebanon. And they will break them small like a calf out of Lebanon. His beloved is like the sons of the unicorns. The voice of the Lord who divided the flame of fire. The voice of the Lord who shaketh the wilderness. Yea, the Lord will shake the wilderness of Cadiz. The voice of the Lord gathereth the hearts and shall reveal the thickets of oak and in his temple every man uttereth glory. The Lord dwelleth in the flood, yea, the Lord shall set his king forever. The Lord will give strength unto his people. The Lord will bless his people with peace. I will exalt thee, O Lord, for thou hast upheld me, and hast not made my foes to rejoice over me. O Lord my God, I cried unto thee, and thou hast healed me. O Lord, uh, thou hast brought up my soul out of Hades. Thou hast saved me from them that go down into the pit. Chant unto the Lord, O ye saints of his. Give thanks at the remembrance of, of his holiness. For wrath is in his anger, but in his will there is life. Yet evening shall weeping find lodging, but in mourning rejoicing. And I said to my prosperity, I shall remain unshaken forever. O Lord, by thy will is a grant of power to my beauty, but thou hast turned away thy face. And I became troubled unto thee, O Lord, will I cry, and unto my God will I make supplication. What profit is there in my blood when I go down into corruption? Shall thus confess thee, or declare thy truth? The Lord, thou hast heard me, and hast had, and hath had mercy on me. The Lord became my helper, thou hast re- turned my mourning into joy for me. Thou hast rent my sackcloth, and girded me with gladness, that my glory may chant unto thee, and may not be pierced with sorrow. O Lord, my God, I will confess thee forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to God. Alleluia, 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 glory to God. Alleluia, 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 glory to God. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. But now, and ever unto the age of David, amen. And the Lord, I hope, let me not be put to shame in the age to come, and in righteousness, deliver me, and rescue me. Bow down and near to me, make haste to rescue me, be thou unto me a God to defend me in a house of refuge to save me for my strength and my refuge art thou and for thy name's sake will thou guide me and nourish me thou will bring me out of this never day fit for me for thou art my defender O Lord and into thy hand will I commit my spirit thou hast redeemed me O Lord God of truth thou hast hated them that cling to empty vanities but I have hoped in the Lord I will rejoice and be glad in thy mercy for thou hast regarded my lowliness and hast saved my soul out of necessities and has not shut me up in the hands of enemies thou hast set my feet in a spacious place have mercy me O Lord for I am afflicted my eyes troubled with anger as also my soul and my belly, for my life is spent with grief, and my years are groaning, my strength has grown weak in poverty, my bones are troubled. I have become a reproach among all mine enemies, and greatly for my neighbors also, and a fear to mine acquaintances. They that saw me without fled from me. For I am begotten and forgotten by the heart like a dead man, and become like a broken vessel, for thou hast heard a voice, for thou hast heard the reproach, reproach of many that dwell round about. When they assemble together against me, they devise to take away my life. But as for me, I have hoped in thee, O Lord, I said, Thou art my God, and thy hands are my lots. Deliver me from the hands of mine enemies, from them that persecute me. Make thy face to shine upon thy service, save me in thy mercy. O Lord, let me not be put to shame, for I have called upon thee. Let the ungodly be put to shame, and let them be brought down into Hades. Speechless be the deceitful lips which speak iniquity against a righteous man with arrogance and contempt. How great is the multitude of thy goodness, O Lord, which I was hid for them that fear thee. Which I will draw for them, and hoping thee before the sons of men, thou shalt hide them in the secrecy of thy presence from the disturbance of men. Thou shalt shelter them in the tabernacle from contradiction of tongues. 
Blessed is the Lord, for he hath made his mercy wonders in a fortified city. But as for me, I sit in mine ecstasy, I am cast away from the presence of thine eyes. Therefore hast thou heard the voice of my supplication when I cried unto thee. O love ye the Lord, all ye his saints, for the Lord requireth truth, and unto them that act with exceeding pride, rendereth them their due. Be ye manful, and let your heart be strengthened, all ye that hope in the Lord. Blessed are they whose iniquities are forgiven, and whose sins are covered. Blessed is the man unto whom the Lord imputes not sin, and whose mouth there is no guile. Because I kept silence, my bones were waxed full through my crying all the day long. For day and night thy hand was heavy upon me, I was reduced to misery, whilst the thorns stuck fast to me. Mine iniquity have I acknowledged, my sin have I not hid. I said, I will confess mine iniquities before the Lord against myself, and thou forgivest the ungodliness of my heart. For this shall everyone that is holy pray unto thee in a seasonable time. Moreover, in a flood of many waters shall they not come nigh unto him. Thou art my refuge from the affliction which surroundeth me. O my rejoicing, deliver me from them which have encircled me. I will instruct thee and teach thee in this way which thou shalt go. I will fix mine eyes upon thee. Be ye not as the horse, nor as a mule, which have no understanding, whose jaws I must hold with pit and bridle, lest they come nigh unto thee. Many are the scourges of the sinner, mercy shall, but mercy shall encircle him that hopeth in the Lord. Be glad in the Lord, and rejoice, O ye righteous, and glory are ye that are upright of heart. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and the unto the ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Our hope, O Lord, glory be to thee. Lord have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord have mercy. Call into remembrance our holy man, for the most blessed glorious man, for the day of the Lord, for the name of the saints, let us commit ourselves to one another in all our life unto Christ our God. Lord. The light is the dominion, the light is the kingdom, of the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Look upon my lowliness with the merciful eye, O Lord. For in a short while my life will be fully spent, and there is no salvation for me because of my deeds. For this cause I pray, look upon my lowliness with a merciful eye, O Lord, and save me. O Lord, rebuke me not in thine anger, nor chase him in thy wrath. <coughs> Be full of care as thou, as though the judge were present, O my soul, and bring to mind the hour of that terrible day. For the judgment is merciful, merciless unto them that have not practiced mercy. Wherefore before thee, and cry out, Spare me, O Savior, for thou alone art the friend of man. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Now and ever and unto the ages of ages, Amen. Holy Spirit. Gate of life, O Immaculate Theotokos, deliver from perils them that have recourse to thee with faith, that we may glorify thine own holy child for the salvation of our soul. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Rejoice in the Lord, ye righteous, praises me for the upright. Give praise to the Lord with the harp, chant unto him with the ten strings psaltery. Sing unto him a new song, chant well unto him with jubilation. For the word of the Lord is true, and all his works are in faithfulness. The Lord loveth mercy and judgment, the earth is full of the mercy of the Lord. By the word of the Lord were the heavens created, and all the might of them by the spirit of his mouth, who gathers together as into a wineskin the waters of the sea, who layeth up the abysses and storehouses. Let all the earth fear the Lord, and let all the inhabitants of the world be shaken before him. For he spake, and they came into being, he commanded, and they were created. The Lord scattered the plans of the heathens, he set aside the devices of peoples, and he bringeth to naught the plans of princes. But the counsel of the Lord abideth unto eternity, the thoughts of his heart unto generation and generation. Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord, the people whom he hath chosen for his inheritance. The Lord looked down from heaven, he beheld all the sons of men, for his inhabitation for his habitation which he prepared, he looked upon all the inhabitants of the earth. He that alone fashioned the heart of them who understandeth all their works. A king is not saved by great might, nor shall a giant be saved by the magnitude of his own strength. Futile is the horse for salvation, nor by the magnitude of his might shall he be saved. Behold, the eyes of the Lord are upon them that fear him, and upon them that hope in his mercy, to deliver their souls from death, and to nourish them in famine. Our soul shall wait for the Lord, for he is our helper and our defender. For our heart shall be glad in him and in his holy name have we hoped. Let thy mercy, O Lord, be upon us according as we have hoped in thee. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. The Lord shall my soul be praised with me, herein be glad. O magnify the Lord with me and let us exalt his name together. I sought the Lord and he heard me and delivered me from all my tribulations. Come unto him and be enlightened, and your faces shall not be ashamed. This poor man cried, and the Lord heard him and saved him out of all his tribulations. The angel of the Lord will encamp round about them that fear him and will deliver them. 
O oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man that hopeth in him. <coughs> o oh, fear the Lord, all ye his saints, for there is no want to them that fear him. Rich men have turned poor and gone hungry, but they that seek the Lord shall not be deprived of any good thing. Come, ye children, hearken unto me, and I will teach you the fear of the Lord. What man is there that desireth life, who loveth to see good days? Keep thy tongue from evil, and thy lips from speaking guile. Turn away from evil, and do good. Seek peace, and pursue it. The eyes of the Lord are upon the righteous, and his ears are open unto their supplication. The face of the Lord is against them that do evil, utterly to destroy the remembrance of them from the earth. The righteous cried, and the Lord heard them, and he delivered them out of all their tribulations. The Lord is nigh unto them that are of a contrite heart, and he will save the humble of spirit. Many are the tribulations of the righteous, and the Lord shall deliver them out of them all. The Lord keepeth all their bones, not one of them shall be broken. The death of sinners is evil, and they that hate the righteous shall do wrong. The Lord will redeem the souls of his servants, and none of them will do wrong that hope in him. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to God. Alleluia, 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 glory to God. Alleluia, 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 glory to God. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages, amen. Judge them, O Lord, that do injustice for against them that are war against me. Take hold of weapon and shield and rise unto my help. Draw out a sword and shut the way against them that persecute me. Say to my soul, I am thy salvation. Let them that seek my soul be shamed and confounded. Let them be turned back and be utterly put to shame, they that devise evils against me. Let them become as dust before the face of the wind, an angel of the Lord also afflicting them. Let their way become darkness and a sliding, an angel of the Lord also pursuing them. For without cause have they secretly prepared for me destruction in their snare. Without treason have they cast reproach on my soul. Let a snare come upon him which he knoweth not. Let the trap which he hath hidden catch him, and into that same snare let him fall. But my soul shall rejoice in the Lord, it shall delight in his salvation. All my bones shall say, Lord, O Lord, who is like unto thee, delivering the beggar from the hand of them that are stronger than he, yea, poor man and pauper, from them that despoil him. Unjust witnesses rose up against me, things I knew not, they asked me. They repaid me with evil things for good and barrenness for my soul. But as for me, when they troubled me, I put on sackcloth, and I humbled my soul with fast, and my prayer shall return into my bosom. As though it had been a neighbor, as though it had been our brother, so sought I to please. As when morning and sat of countenance, so humbled I myself. Yet against me they rejoiced and gathered together, scourges were gathered together upon me, and I knew it not. They were rent asunder, they pricked me, yet not pricked I, they were rent asunder, yet not pricked at heart. They tempted me, they mocked me with mockery, they gnashed upon me with their teeth. O Lord, when wilt thou look upon me, deliver my soul from their evil doings, even this only begotten one of mine from the lions? I will confess thee in the great congregation among the mighty people will I praise thee. Let not them that rejoice against me be unjustly are mine enemies. Let not them rejoice against me that unjustly are mine enemies. They that hate me without a cause and weep with their eyes. Repeatedly indeed they spake unto me, but in their wrath they were devising deceits. And they opened wide their mouth against me. They said, Well done, well done, our eyes have seen it. Thou hast seen it, O Lord. Keep not silence, O Lord. Depart not from me. Arise, O Lord, and be attentive unto my judgment, my God and my Lord, and to my cause. Judge me, O Lord, according to my, thy righteousness, O Lord, my God. Let them not rejoice against me. Let them not say in their hearts, well done, well done, our soul. Let them not say we have swallowed him up. Let them be shamed and confounded together who rejoice at my woes. Let them be clothed with shame and confusion who speak boastful words against me. Let them rejoice and be glad or desire the righteousness of my cause. And let them that desire the peace of thy servant say continually, the Lord be magnified. And my tongue shall rejoice in thy righteousness and of thy praise all the day long. The transgressor that he may sin saith to himself that there is no fear of God before his eyes. For he hath wrought craftiness before him, lest he should find his iniquity and hate it. The words of his mouth are iniquity and deceit. He hath not willed to understand how to do good. Iniquity hath he devised upon his bed. He hath set himself in every way that is not good, and evil hath he not abhorred. O Lord, thy mercy is in heaven, and thy truth reacheth under the clouds. Thy righteousness is as the mountains of God. Thy judgments are a great abyss. Men and beasts shalt thou save, O Lord. Thou hast multiplied thy mercy, O God. Let the sons of men hope in the shelter of thy wings. They shall be drunken with the fatness of thy house, of, thy, of the torrent of thy delight. Thou shalt make them to drink. For in thee is the fountain of life, and thy light shall we see light. O continue thy mercy unto them that know thee, and thy righteousness unto the upright of heart. Let not the foot of pride come upon me, nor let the hand of the sinner move me. Yonder be fallen all they that work iniquity. They shall be cast out and shall not be able to stand. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. <coughs>
Amen. Alleluia, 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 Glück, O Gott. Alleluia, 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 Glück, O Gott. Alleluia, 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 Glück, O Gott. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Good not thyself because of evil doers, nor envy them that work iniquity. For like grass quickly shall they be withered, and like green herbs quickly shall they fall away. Hope in the Lord, and do good, and dwell on the earth, and like a shepherd shalt thou be fed with its riches. Delight thyself in the Lord, and he will give thee the askings of thy heart. Disclose unto the Lord thy ways, and trust in him, and he shall bring it to pass. And he shall bring forth thy righteousness as light, and thy judgment as the noonday. Submit thyself in the Lord, and supplicate him. Fret not thyself because of him that prospereth in his way, nor because of a man that doeth iniquity. Cease from wrath and forsake anger, for set, fret not thyself so as to do evil. For evildoers shall utterly perish, but they that wait on the Lord, they shall inherit the earth. And yet a little while in the sinner shall not be, and thou shalt seek for his place, and shall not find it. But the meek shall inherit the earth, and shall delight themselves in an abundance of peace. The sinner will diligently keep walk, watch over the righteous man, will gnash with his teeth upon him. But the Lord shall laugh at him, because he foreseeth that his day will come. The sinners have drawn a sword, they have bent their bow to cast down a poor man in poverty to slay the upright in heart. Let their sword enter into their own hearts, and let their bow, bows be broken. Better is the little which a just man hath than the great riches of sinners. For the arms of the sinners shall be broken, but the Lord upholdeth the righteous. The Lord knoweth the ways of the blameless, and their inheritance shall be forever. They shall not be put to shame in an evil time, and days of famine they shall be filled. But the sinners shall perish in the enemies of the Lord in the moment when they are glorified and exalted. Vanish away, and like smoke have they vanished away. The sinner borroweth and will not repay, but the just man showeth mercy and giveth. For they that bless him shall inherit the earth, but they that curse him shall, be, uh, shall utterly perish. By the Lord of the steps of a man rightly direct in his way shall he greatly desire. When he falleth, he shall not be utterly cast down, for the Lord upholdeth his hand. I have been young, and now indeed I am grown old, and I have not seen his right, the righteous man forsaken, nor his seed begging bread. All day long the righteous showeth mercy, and lendeth, and his seed shall be unto blessing. Decline from evil, and do good, and dwell unto ages of ages. For the Lord loveth judgment, and he will not forsake his holy ones, they shall be kept forever. But the wicked shall be banished, and the seed of the ungodly shall be utterly destroyed. The righteous shall inherit the earth, and shall dwell therein into ages of ages. The mouth of the righteous shall meditate wisdom, and his tongue shall speak of judgment. The law of his God is in his heart, and his steps shall not be tripped. The sinner watcheth the righteous man, and seeketh to slay him. But the Lord will not abandon him to his hands, nor in any way condemn him when he judgeth him. Wait on the Lord and keep his way, and he shall inherit he shall exalt thee to inherit the earth. When sinners are utterly destroyed, thou shalt see it. I have seen the ungodly man highly exalted and lifting himself up like the cedars of Lebanon. But I passed by, and lo, he was not, and I sought him, and his place was not to be found. Keep innocence and behold uprightness, for there is a remnant for the peaceable man. But the transgressors shall be utterly destroyed together, and the remnants of the ungodly shall be utterly destroyed. But the salvation of the righteous is from the Lord, and he is their defender in a time of affliction. And the Lord shall help them and shall deliver them, and he will rescue them from sinners and will save them, because they have hoped in him. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to thee, O God. Our hope, O Lord, glory be to thee. Again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Help us save us from mercy on us and keep us, O God, by their grace. Calling to remembrance for our holy Immaculate, the most blessed and glorious Lord, 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 for a good and man, befriending God, art thou unto thee, to the Son of glory, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. As the divine first fruit of the past, let us acquire compunction of soul, crying out, O Master Christ, receive our prayer like choice incense, and deliver us from foul-smelling corruption and dreadful punishment, since Thou alone art easily reconciled. Glory to the Father, and the, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and the Holy Spirit. As the divine first fruits of the fast, let us acquire compunction of soul, crying out, O Master Christ, receive our prayer like choice incense, and deliver us from foul smell and corruption and dreadful punishment, since Thou alone art easily reconciled. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages, Amen. Since Thou art a wellspring of pity, count us worthy of compassion, O Theotokos, look upon a sinful 
people show forth as always thy power. For hoping in thee we cry rejoice unto thee, as once did Gabriel, the supreme commander of the bodiless host. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now and to the ages of ages. Amen. O Lord, rebuke me not in any anger, nor chase me in thy wrath, for thine arrows are fastened in me. Thou hast laid thy hand heavily upon me. There is no healing in my flesh in the face of thy wrath, and there is no peace in my bones in the face of my sins. For mine iniquities are risen higher than my head is a heavy burden, and depressively upon me. My bruises have become noisome and corrupt in the face of my folly. I've been wretched and utterly bound down to the end. All day long, I went with downcast face, for my loins are filled with mockings, and there is no healing in my flesh. I am afflicted and humbled exceedingly. I have roared from the groaning of my heart, O Lord, before thee is all my desire. My groaning is not hid from thee. My heart is troubled. My strength have failed me. In the light of mine eyes, if this is not with me, my friends and my neighbors drew nigh over it against me and stood in my nearest again, stood afar off. And they that sought out my soul used violence, and they that sought evils from me, for me spake vain things in craftiness as all day long did they meditate. But as for me, like a deaf man, I heard them not, and was as a speechless man, and openeth not his mouth, and I became as a man that heareth not, and it hath in his mouth no reproofs. For in thee, I hope, O Lord, thou wilt hearken unto me, O Lord my God. For I said, Let never my enemies rejoice over me, yea, when my feet were shaken, as men spake false words against me. For I am ready for scourges, my sorrow is continually before me, for I will declare mine iniquity, and I will take heed concerning my sin. But mine enemies live, and are made stronger than I. And they that hated me unjustly are multiplied, they that render me evil for good slander me, because I pursue goodness. Forsake me not, O Lord my God, depart not from me. Be attentive unto my help, O Lord of my salvation. I said, I will take heed to my ways, lest I sin with my tongue. I set a guard from my mouth when the sinner stood up against me. I was dumb and was humbled and held my peace, even from good, and my sorrow was stirred anew. My heart grew hot within me, my meditation with fire was kindled. I spake with my tongue, O Lord, make me to know my end and the number of my days, but it is that I may know what I lack. Behold, thou hast made my days as a span of a hand, and my being as is nothing before thee, nay, all things are vanity, every man living. Surely man walketh about like a phantom, nay, in vain that he disquiet himself, he layeth up treasure, and knoweth not for whom he shall gather it. And now what is my patient endurance is not the Lord, yea, my hope is from thee. From all mine iniquities, deliver me. Thou hast made me reproach through the foolish. I was dumb, and open not my mouth, for thou hast made me take away from me thy scourges, for from the strength of thy hand have I fainted. With reprovings for iniquity has all chastened man, and has made his life to melt away like a spider's web. Nay, in vain doth every man disquiet himself. Hearken unto my prayer, O Lord, unto my supplication. If ye are to my tears, be not silent, for I am a sojourner with thee, and a stranger as were all my fathers. Spare me, that I may be refreshed before I go hence, and be no more. With patience I waited patiently for the Lord, and he was attentive unto me, and he hearkened unto my supplication, and he brought me up out of the pit of misery and from the mire of clay. And he set my feet upon a rock, and he ordered my steps aright. He hath put in my mouth a new song, a hymn unto our God. Many shall see, and shall fear, and shall hope in the Lord. Blessed is a man whose hope is in the name of the Lord, who hath not looked upon vanities and false frenzies. Many, O Lord my God, are thy wonders which I was wrought, and in thy thoughts there is none that should be likened unto thee. I declared and spake, they are multiplied beyond number. Sacrifice and offering has thou not desired, but a body is thou perfected for me. Over <coughs> offerings and oblations for sin as I will not demand it. But then I said, Behold, I am come, and the head and of the book is written concerning me to do thy will, O my God, and I lost in the midst of my vows. I proclaim the good tidings of thy righteousness in a great congregation. Lo, my lips shall not restrain, Lord, thou knowest it. Thy righteousness have I not hid in my heart, and thy truth and thy salvation have I declared. I have not concealed thy mercy, nor the truth in the great assemblage. But thou, Lord, remove not thy compassions far from me. Let thy mercy and thy truth continually help me, for evils without number have encompassed me. My iniquities took hold of me, and I became unable to see. They are multiplied more than the hairs of my head, my, and my heart has failed me. Be pleased, O Lord, deliver me. O Lord, be attentive unto helping me. Let them be shamed and confounded together, which seek after my soul to destroy it. Let them be turned back and confounded that desire evils for me. Let them, be quick, let them quickly receive shame for their reward. You say to me, well done, well done. Let them rejoice and be glad in thee, all they that seek after thee, O Lord, and let them that love thy salvation continually say, The Lord be magnified. But as for me, a poor man of mine, a pauper, and the Lord will care for me. My helper, my defender, art thou, O Lord, make, O God, make no daring. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to God. Alleluia, 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 glory to God. Alleluia, 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 glory to God. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. But now, and then, to the ages of ages, amen. Blessed is the man that hath understanding for the poor men, and the pauper and evil day the Lord will deliver him. May the Lord keep him and make him to live, and make him blessed upon the earth, and another surrender him into the hands of his enemies. May the Lord help him on his bed of pain, the whole of his confinement, and his sickness as I'll turn to the better. I said, O Lord, have mercy on me, heal my soul, for I have sinned against thee. 
Mine enemies have spoken evil things against me. When shall he die? When shall his name perish? And though he came to see me, his heart spake vanity. He gathered iniquity unto himself. He went forth and spake in a like manner. All mine enemies whispered against me, against me, that devised evils for me, and unjust word they said against me. Can it be that he this sleeper shall rise up again? Yea, even a man of my peace, in whom I hope to aid of my bread, hath magnified the lifting of heels against me. But thou, Lord, be merciful unto me, and raise me up, and I requite them. By this I know that thou hast delighted in me, because mine enemy shall not rejoice over me. And because of my innocence, thou hast helped me, and hast established me before thee forever. Blessed is the Lord God of Israel, from everlasting to everlasting, so be it, so be it. As a heart panteth at the fountains of water, so panteth my soul after thee, O God. My soul thirsteth for God, the mighty, the living. When shall I come in every year before the face of God? My tears have been my bread by day and by night, whilst it is said to me daily, Where is thy God? These things have you remembered, and I poured out my soul within me, for I should go to the place of the wondrous tabernacle, even to the house of God, with the voice of rejoicing and thanksgiving. Yea, the sound of them may keep festival. Why art thou cast down on my soul, then why dost thou disquiet me? Hope in God, for I will give thanks unto him. He is the salvation of my countenance, my God. Within me my soul hath been troubled. I, uh, therefore, will I remember thee from the land of Jordan and Hermonium, the little, and from the little mountain. Deep calleth on the deep. At the voice of thy cataracts, all thy billows and thy waves have passed over me. By day the Lord will command his mercy, and by night his oath shall be with me. My prayer unto the God of my life, I will say unto God that thou art my helper. Why hast thou forgotten me, and wherefore go I with downcast face, whilst my enemy afflicteth me, whilst my bones are broken, mine enemies reproach me, whilst they said to me daily, Where is thy God? Why art thou cast down on my soul, and why dost thou describe me, hoping God, for I will give thanks unto him? He is the salvation of my countenance, and my God. Judge me, O God, and give judgment in my cause against a nation that is not holy from an unjust from a, from a man unjust and crafty deliver me, for thou, O God, art my strength. Wherefore hast thou cast me off, and wherefore go I with downcast face, whilst my enemy afflicteth me? Will send out thy light and thy truth, they have guided me along the way, and brought me into thy holy mountain, and into thy tabernacles, and I shall go into the altar of God, unto God, who give gladness to my youth. I will give praise unto thee, O God, my God, with a harp, why art thou cast down on my soul, and why dost thou disquiet me, hoping God, for I will give thanks unto him. He is the salvation of my countenance, and my God, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. <laughs> Both now and ever unto the ages of ages of men, O God, with our ears have we heard, for our fathers have told us the works which I was wrought in their days and in the days of old, thy hand utterly destroy the heathen, and in their stead thou dost plant them, thou dost bring evils upon those people, and didst cast them out, for not by their own sword did they inherit the land, nor did their own arms save them. But thy right hand and thine arm and the light of thy countenance, because thou was well pleased in them. Thou thyself art my king and my God, thou that commandest the salvation of Jacob. Through thee shall the horn of our strength push down our enemies, and through thy name shall we bring to naught them that rise up against us. For not of my bow will I hope, and my sword shall not save me. For thou hast saved us from them, and afflict us in them, and hatest us, so put to shame. And God will bless all the day long, and in thy name will we give praise in the age to come. But now thou hast cast us off, and put us to shame, and will not go forth, O God, with our host. Thou hast made us to turn back before our enemies, and them that and they that hate us took spoil for themselves. Thou hast given us a sheep to be eaten amongst the nations, as thou scattered us. Thou hast sold thy people without a price, and there was no gain in the selling of us. Thou hast made us a reproach to our neighbors, a scorn and derision to them that are round about us. Thou hast made us a byword among the nations, a shaking of the head among the peoples. All the day long my disgrace is before me, and the shame of my face hath covered me. And because of the voice of him that reproacheth and revileth, because of the face of the enemy and pursuer, all this hath come upon us, and we have not forgotten thee, nor have we dealt unrighteously in thy covenant. Though our heart had not turned back, yet thou hast turned aside our paths from thy ways. For thou hast humbled us, humbled us in a place of affliction, and the shadow of death that covered us. If we have forgotten the name of our God, if we have stretched out our hands to a strange God, shall not God search out these things, for he knoweth the secrets of the heart. For thy sake we are slain all the day long, we are counted as sheep for the slaughter. Rise up, wisely, sleepest thou, O Lord, arise, and cast us not off at the end. Wherefore turnest thou thy face away, dost thou forget our poverty and our affliction? For our soul hath been humbled down to the dust, our belly hath cleaved to the earth. Arise, O Lord, help us and redeem us for thy name's sake. My heart had poured forth a good word, my eyes spake of my works to the king, my tongue is a pen of a swiftly writing scribe, and comely art thou in beauty more than the sons of men. Grace hath been poured forth on thy lips, wherefore God hath blessed thee forever. Gird thy sword upon thy thigh, O mighty one, and thy comeliness, and thy beauty, and bend thy bow, and proceed prosperously, and be king, because of truth, and meekness, and righteousness. In thy right hand shall guide thee wondrously, thine arrows are sharp, O mighty one, under thee shall people swallow, sharper in the heart, heart in the, uh, of the enemies of the king. Thy throne, O God, is forever and ever, a scepter of uprightness is the scepter of the kingdom. 
Those love righteousness and hated iniquity, wherefore God thy God hath anointed thee with the oil of gladness more than thy fellows, myrrh and Stasky and Cassie excel from thy garments, from thy ivory palaces, whereby they made thee glad, they the daughters of the kings in thine honour. At thy right hand at thy right hand stood the queen arrayed in a vesture of woven gold and dored in varied colours. Hearken, O daughter, and see, and incline thine ear, and forget thine own people in thy father's house. And the king shall greatly desire thy beauty, for he himself is thy lord, and thou shalt worship him. And him shall the daughters of Tyre worship with gifts. The rich among the people shall entreat thy countenance. All the glory of the daughter of thy king is within, with gold fringed garments is she arrayed, adorned in varied colors. The virgins that follow after her shall be brought unto thee. The king, those near her, shall be brought unto thee. They shall be brought with gladness and rejoicing. They shall be brought into the temple of the king. In the stead of their father's sons are born to thee. Thou shalt make them princes over all the earth. I shall commemorate thy name in every generation and generation. Therefore shall peoples give praise unto thee forever and unto the ages of ages. Our God is refuge and strength and helper in afflictions with Michael the Prophet. Therefore shall we not fear when the earth be shaken, nor when the mountains be removed into the heart of the seas. The waters roared and were troubled, the mountains were troubled by his might. The rushings of the river make glad the city of God, the Most High, hallowed his tabernacle. God is in the midst of her, she shall not be shaken. God shall help her right early in the morning. The nations were troubled, kingdoms tottered, the Most High gave forth his voice. The earth was shaken, the Lord of hosts is with us, our helper is the God of Jacob. Come and behold the works of God, with marvelous he hath wrought on the earth, making wars to cease unto the ends of the earth. He will crush the bow and will shatter the weapon, and shields will the utterly burn with fire. Be still and know that I am God, I will be exalted among the nations, I will be exalted in the earth. The Lord of hosts is with us, our helper is the God of Jacob. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, for now and unto the, the age of ages of men. Alleluia, 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 glory to the O God, alleluia, 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 glory to the O God, alleluia, 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 glory to the O God, our hope, O Lord, glory be to thee. Lord have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by the grace. Lord have mercy. Calling to remembrance our holy Mac, to the most blessed glory, say, say, O God, and our Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commit ourselves to one another and all our life unto Christ our to God. The Lord. For blessed is thy name, and glorified is thy kingdom of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever unto the ages of ages. Amen. Let us joyfully begin the period of all venerable abstinence, shining out with the rays of the holy commandments of Christ our God, and with the brightness of love, the lightning of prayer, the cleanliness of purity, the strength of courage, so that we, being brightly clad, might attain unto the holy resurrection on the third day, which shineth with incorruption upon the world. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Let us joyfully begin the period of the all venerable abstinence, shining out with the rays of, of the holy commandments of Christ our God, and with the brightness of love, the lightning of prayer, the cleanliness of purity, the strength of courage, so that we, being brightly clad, might attain unto the holy resurrection on the third day, which shineth with, incorru which shineth with incorruption upon the world. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages, amen, possessing thine invincible intercession. In troubles beyond all hope, I am marvelously delivered from them that afflict me, O Mother of God. For thou dost always anticipate them that ask thee in faith, driving away the gloom of their many sins. Wherefore we cry to thee thankfully, receive my trifling hymns of thanksgiving, O Lady, for all the things wherein thou art my helper. Have mercy on me, O God, according to your mercy, and according to the mouth of thy compassion, has blotted up my transgression, wash me thoroughly from my iniquity, and cleanse me from my sin. For I know my iniquity, my sin is ever before me against thee, only have I sinned and done this evil before thee, that thou mightest be justified in thy words, and prevail thou were judged. For behold, thou was conceived in iniquities and in sins, and my mother bare me, for behold, thou hast of truth, the hidden and seek things of thy wisdom, hast thou made manifest unto me. Thou shalt sprinkle me with this, but I shall make clean. Thou shalt wash me, and I shall make white in the snow. Thou shalt make me hear joy and gladness. The bones that be humbled, they shall rejoice. Turn thy face away from my sins, and blot out all my iniquities. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. Cast me not away from thy presence, and take not thy Holy Spirit from me. Restore unto me the joy of thy salvation, and with thy governing spirit establish me. <coughs> I shall teach transgressors thy ways, and the ungodly shall turn back unto thee. Deliver me from the guiltiness, O God, the God of my salvation, my tongue shall rejoice in the righteousness. 
O Lord, thou shalt open my lips, and my mouth shall declare thy praise. If thou hast desired sacrifice, I'd give it with over offerings, I shall not be pleased. The sacrifice unto God is a broken spirit, a heart that is broken, humble, God will not despise. Do good, O Lord, and thy good pleasure in the, in the sign, and let the walls of Jerusalem be builded. That shall be pleased with the sacrifice of righteousness, with the blaze of offerings, that shall the offer bullocks upon their altar. Save, O God, thy people, and bless thy inheritance. Visit the world with mercy and compassion. Exalt the one of Orthodox Christians and send down upon us thy rich mercies. By the intercessions of our all night, we the to the Virgin Mary, by the power of the honor of life, to the cross, for the protection of all the heavens, and powers, for the supplications of the most glorious cross, the poor honor of the John, for our holy patron, John, and the expert church, which you preserve, and the sisters of the Father. For the holy and righteous ancestors of God, Jehovah, King of Anna, us, the holy, righteous, martyr, Cornel, and Saria, and his fellow martyr, Nessius, our righteous father, Mark the ascetic, the wonder worker, and our righteous father, Nicholas Felmirovich, whose memory we celebrated of all the saints, we beseech the only great and merciful God, hearken unto us, and we pray unto thee, and have mercy on us. By the mercy and compassion and love for man of the only begotten Son, with whom thou art blessed, together with thy noble holy and good and life creating spirit, now and ever unto the ages of ages. Amen. <coughs> Let us sing to the Lord, for glorious is he glorified, horse and rider, he drove into the sea, a helper and protector was he unto me for salvation. This is my God, and I will glorify him, the God of my Father, and I will exalt him. The Lord quenching wars, Lord is his name. The chariots of Pharaoh and his hosts, he rode into the sea, they chose him out to the captains, he plunged into the Red Sea. With the open sea he covered them, they sank into the deep like a stone. Thy right hand, O Lord, is glorified in the strength, thy right hand hath, O Lord, has shattered enemies. Or <coughs> in the multitude of the, thy right hand, O Lord, hath shattered enemies, and in the multitude of thy glory hast thou ground down the adversaries. Thou sendest forth thy wrath, they consumed them like stubble. And at the breath of thy wrath, the water parted asunder. The waters were hardened like a wall. Hardened also were the waves in the midst of the sea. The enemy said, I will pursue, I will overtake, I will divide the spoil. I will satisfy my soul, I will destroy with my sword. My right hand shall have dominion. Thou sendest forth thy breath, the sea covered them. They sank like lead in the turbulent water. Who is like unto thee among the gods of the Lord? Who is like unto thee, glorified in holies? The enemy said, I will pursue, I will overtake, I will divide the spoil, I will satisfy my soul, I will destroy with my sword, my right hand shall have dominion. Unto our Savior and God, who guided the people dry shot in the sea, and drowned Pharaoh with all his forces, to him alone let us sing, for he is glorified. Thou sendest forth thy breath, the sea covered them, they sank like lead in the turbulent water. Let Conan, the right victorious martyr, now be praised for being enlisted for Christ the King over all. He fought valiantly against error and had put on the incorruptible crown. Who is like unto thee among the gods, O Lord? Who is like unto thee, glorified in holies, wonderful and glorious, doing marvels? The longing for the hidden life and glory that groweth not old, the glorious martyr Conan exchanged them for a luxury for them. Let us honor him in song, in song, for he is glorified. Thou stretch forth thy right hand, the earth swallowed them up. Wrapped about now with the garment of incorruption of glorious Conan, thou hast been grafted from the root of a, of a wild olive tree into a good olive tree, bearing as fruit to Christ those whom thou didst plant. Thou hast guided them by thy righteousness, this thy people whom thou hast redeemed. Thou hast called them by thy strength of, into thy holy habitation. Loosed from our forefathers, curse of corruption, the all renowned martyr shook off the yoke of error and made purity his yoke mate and companion. The nations heard and waxed wrath, pangs took hold of them that dwell in Philistia. O Immaculate Mother of God, unceasingly entreat the God who was incarnate of thee without departing from the Father's bosom that our souls be saved. Then did the rulers of Edom hasten, and the princes of the Moabites trembling took hold of them, and the dwellers of Canaan melted away. How shall I now bewail my fall? What beginning shall I make of my salvation, I who have lived as a prodigal? O but, compassionate one, by the judges of San Noah, save me. Behold, the time has come. Behold, the day of salvation, the entrance of the fast. Be vigilant, O my soul, and shut up the entrances of passions, looking steadfastly to the Lord. Let fear and trembling fall upon them by the greatness of thine arm, and let them be made like unto stone. The swelling waves of my sins <clears throat> tosseth me about and draweth me down into the deep of despair, but I run to the gulf of thy mercy. O Lord, save me. Until thy people pass over, O Lord, until they pass over, even this thy people which thou didst take for thine own. 
I alone am become enslaved unto sin. I alone have opened the door to the passions of word who are easily reconciled. Turn me back. Save me in thy compassion. Bring them in and plant them in the mountain of thine inheritance, in thy prepared habitation which thou hast fashioned, O Lord, even the sanctuary which thy hands have prepared. O maiden, who alone art exceedingly graced of God, who has concealed who has conceived the wellspring of this passion, heal me wounded as I am with passions and snatch me away from the everlasting fire. The Lord is King of the ages, yea, forever and evermore. Come, O you people, let us welcome today the gift of the fast as the God-given season of repentance, wherein let us make the Savior gracious unto us. For the horse of Pharaoh with chariots and riders went into the sea, and the Lord brought upon them the water of the sea. But the sons of Israel walked through dry land in the midst of the sea. Now hath the season of struggles arrived, the race course of the fast has come. Let us all eagerly make a beginning thereof, bringing the Lord virtues as a gift. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O simple unity of three lights, unity sovereign over all, exceedingly all-powerful, all-living God and Lord, the Father Almighty, the Son, and the Spirit, save them that worship Thee. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Let us hymn the holy mountain of God, Mary the undefiled, from whom the Son of Righteousness Christ, the life of all, rose upon those in darkness. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. A chariot of fire took the marvelous Elias, who was armed with fasting, and showed Moses to be a seer of ineffable things, and we, if we take it up, shall behold Christ. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. Adam ate the food, and intemperance thrust him out of paradise, but the fast laying hold upon us. O Lord, thou friend, thou friend of man, shall show us to be worthy of repentance. Come, O ye people, let us sing a song unto Christ God, who divided the sea and made a way for the people which he had brought up out of the bondage of Egypt, for he is glorified. The Lord hath gone up into the heavens and hath thundered. He will judge the ends of the earth, for he is righteous. Thou didst choose to worship God, longing for the light of glorious cotton, but thou didst abhor the gloomy godlessness of the idols. And he will give strength to our kings, and he will lift up the horn of his anointed one. Eagerly sacrificing soul and body to Christ, and being graciously accepted, thou didst converse with the Master as alone with him alone, O blessed one. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Thou didst wisely free innumerable peoples from the loss of their fathers, triumphing over Apollo, the namesake of perdition of glorious Conan. O now and ever and unto the ages of ages, amen. Unceasingly entreat him that came forth from thy loins of pure wonder, they who praise thee as the mother of God, be rescued from the error of the devil. <coughs> By the power of thy cross of Christ, do thou make steadfast mine understanding, that I may now him and glorify thy will in crucifixion. The fast has come, the mother of chastity. What was the time before this day? A time, a time of fornication. The soul has fornicated with all that struck its eyes as pleasant, both with people and with things, and more fully with sinful passions. Everyone has his own passion, which he pleases in every way. It is time to put an end to this. May each of you comprehend your Delilah, who binds you and hands you over to evil enemies and abandon her. Then you will be given more than Samson was given. Not only shall your hair grow, but so also shall good thoughts, and not only shall your strength return, but so also your strength of will. Your eyes shall also open, your mind shall have sight, and it shall see the Lord yourself and everything around you in the proper light. Behold, now is the favorable time. Behold, now is the day of salvation. The prayers of our Holy Master, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. 
Mr. All Holy Immaculate, most blessed glory, say the Theotokos, and every virgin of all the saints. Let us commit ourselves to one another in all our life unto Christ our God. For thou art our God, and unto thee do we send up glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. From infancy didst thou cleave to God, O God bearer, becoming the good spirit's most honorable vessel, and thou dost subject the most evil spirits to thy command. Rightly art thou magnified, since thou hast contended, hence we all keep feast. With faithful fame, Father Conan, on thy holy memory. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Both now and ever, and to the angels of ages. Amen. O God, my righteous soul, and take pity upon it, which burdened with the load of offenses, is slipping to depths of destruction, where all is lost, O a blameless one. In the fearful hour of death, deliver me swiftly from accusing demons, O a pure Virgin Mary, and save me, I pray of thee. I have heard of thy rising from the grave, O Lord, and I glorify thy invincible power. O Lord, is King of the ages, yea, forever and evermore. Thou didst cast down the deceiver of the people, so blessed Conan, and didst manifest the divinity of Jesus. For the horse of the Pharaoh with chariots and riders went into the sea, and the Lord brought upon them the water of the sea. But the sons of Israel walked through the dry land in the midst of the sea. The false god made of stone trembling as of thy rebuke confessed Jesus alone to be God. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The foolish became wise, accepting the altogether truthful retraction supernaturally heard from lips of stone. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. We the faithful glorify thee as literally the Mother of God, O unwedded Virgin, and we flee unto thy haven. <clears throat> Waking at dawn, we cry unto thee, O Lord, save us, for thou art our God. Beside thee we know none other. For the dew which thou sendest is healing for them, but the land of the ungodly shall perish. Grace hath made thee... To be a vessel of the immaculate and unmingled light of glory and boast of martyrs. Go, my people, into thine inner chamber, shut thy door, hide thyself for a little while until the wrath of the Lord shall pass away. Thou didst abound with the divine knowledge of unspeakable words, and didst instruct innumerable peoples therein, O supremely honorable Conan. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Beholding the grace of thy wonders, the Lord has cried out, The God of Conan hath triumphed over error. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. We praise thee as a virgin after childbearing, O Theotokos, for thou bearest God of the word in the flesh for the sake of the world. They that observe vain and false things have abandoned mercy for themselves. The abyss, by thine entreaties, grace was an increase of riches for them that believe, but for disobedient instant destruction, O blessed Conan. But as for me, with the voice of praise and thanksgiving will I sacrifice unto thee, whosoever, whatsoever I have vowed for my salvation, I will pay unto, the, unto thee, O Lord. The hordes of demons were truly subject to thee that had subjected thyself unto God, who of his own authority created thee, O blessed and glorious martyr Conan. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. By thee were the multitudes chastened, taught by deed and word to choose mercy, and in God to abhor avaricious ways, O blessed Conan. Both now and ever unto the ages of ages, amen. As is meet, we glorify thee as the bush that was not consumed, and a mountain and living ladder and heavenly gate of glorious Mary, boast of the Orthodox. <coughs> And the abyss hath as is meet me. The abyss hath encompassed me. The sea monster is become my grave. But I cried unto thee, the friend of man, and thy right hand to save me, O Lord. Again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord and help us save us of mercy and us and keep us, O God, by Lord thy grace. Mercy. Calling to remembrance our holy man, the most blessed grace, the Theotokos, and every true merit of the saints. Let us commit ourselves to one another in all our life unto Christ Lord, our God. Lord. For thou art the King of peace and the Savior of our souls, and unto thee do we send up glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Ye have proved to be spiritual luminaries, the holy martyrs, for through faith ye utterly destroyed the gross mist of error. Ye made the lamps of your souls to shine brightly, and ye have entered with the bridegroom in glory into the heavenly bridal chamber. And now we pray, make entreaty that our souls may be saved. Synexarian, on the fifth of this one month, we commemorate the holy righteous martyr Conan of Isaria. To the very God thou goest, a God by adoption, and thy dust, dost thou leave to the earth, O Father Conan, on the, on the fifth, stout-hearted Conan, give up his soul. On this day we commemorate the holy martyr Nestius, companion of St. Conan Nestoria. On this day we commemorate the holy martyr Conan, the gardener of Nazareth in Galilee. To the Lord who beareth the prince of the nails, Conan draweth nigh, bearing them in his feet. On this day we commemorate the righteous father, Mark, the ascetic, the wonder worker, the God-bearer, 
After the custom of the dead, O Mark, thou art silent. But though, but though thou be dead, I shall not consign thee to silence. On this day of commitment to holy martyr, Evlogius of Palestine, Evlogius of Eulogius, from all creation, for his head was cut off for thy sake, O Creator. On this day of commitment to holy martyr, Elampius of Palestine, as Elampius' neck with the sword is now severed, the stiff neck of ungodliness he sorely shameth on this day. The holy martyr Archelaus and the 142 martyrs with him were perfected and martyred by the sword. When Archelaus arched his blessed neck first before the sword, he cut free the path of divine people of the Lord. On this day we commemorate our righteous and God-bearing father, Mark of Athens, who struggled in asceticism on the mountain of Thrace, which is beyond the land of the Ketians. O God-bearing Mark, being gone far from Athens, thou didst live in the wilderness like an angel. On this day, we remember the holy new martyr John of Bulgaria, who was beheaded in Constantinople in the year 1784. Why portrayest thou the cross of John most blessed? Because, crieth he, I am the, the Lord's disciple. On this day, we remember the holy virgin martyr Olive of Brescia, who suffered in the reign of Hadrian. On this day, we remember the righteous father Kieran, bishop, and abbot of Sigir, which is called the firstborn of the Irish, who is called the firstborn of the Irish saints. On this day we commemorate to recover the holy relics of Saint Theodore, Prince of Smolensk, and Yaroslavl and of his children, David and Constantine. On this day we commemorate our righteous father, Adrian of Pashakonia, and his fellow ascetic Leonidas, by the holy intercessions of God, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. O thou who didst save the children who praise thee in the furnace of fire, blessed art thou, God of our fathers. Blessed art thou upon the throne of the glory of thy kingdom, thou who art supremely praised, supremely exalted unto the ages. Contending in martyrdom, O Athlete, thou didst cry, Blessed is the God of our fathers. Blessed art thou on the firmament of the heaven, thou who art supremely praised, and supremely exalted unto the ages. Conquering the enemy, thou wast shown to be a prize winner, crying out, Blessed is the God of our fathers. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Thou hast received the name of Victor upon the earth, and the <laughs> in the heavens, so invincible martyr of Christ. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O thou who was born of a virgin, making her that thou thought was blessed, are thou the God of our fathers. Blessed are all ye works of the Lord, and praise the Lord, and supremely exalt him unto the ages. Blessed are the angels of the Lord, and ye heavens of the Lord, and praise the Lord, and supremely exalt him unto the ages. Blessed are all ye waters above the heavens, and all ye powers of the Lord, and praise the Lord, and supremely exalt him unto the ages. Blessed are the sun and moon, and ye stars of heaven, and praise the Lord, and supremely exalt him unto the ages. Blessed are every rain and dew, and all ye winds. O praise the Lord, and supremely exalt him unto the ages. Blessed the Lord. Fire and heat of burning, winter heat, winter cold and summer heat. O oh, praise the Lord, and supremely exalt Him unto the ages. The I am said of unto the God the Son, who was begotten of the Father before the ages, and was incarnate of a virgin mother. In these last times, give praise, O ye priests, and supremely exalt Him, O ye people, unto all the ages. But sort of falls of dew and snow, ice and cold. O oh, praise the Lord, and supremely exalt Him unto the ages. Seeing the world ruler of darkness spoiled of superstitious error through the saints' supplications, praise Christ, O ye priests, and supremely exalt Him, O ye people, unto the ages. But sort of hoar frost and snow, so lightnings <coughs> and clouds. O oh, praise the Lord, and supremely exalt Him unto the ages. In a manner befitting God, the assemblies of evil doers tormented by the spirits of this. Instruction cried out to thee, O blessed Conan, praise Christ, O ye priests, and supremely exalt them, O ye people, unto the ages. Blessed Lord of light and darkness, O nights and days, O praise you, Lord, and supremely exalt them unto the ages. By thine effectual command, thou didst preserve the infant in the jaws of the wild beast, unheard as in a mother's arms, as thou didst cry unceasingly, praise Christ, O ye priests, and supremely exalt them, O ye peoples, unto the ages. Blessed Lord of earth, mountains, and hills, and all things that spring up therein, O praise you, Lord, and supremely exalt them unto the ages. And thou wast abundantly illuminated with the light of three sons of athletes, for extolling the nature of three hypostases, thou didst shout, Praise Christ, O ye priests, and supremely exalt them, O ye peoples, unto the ages. Bless the Lord of fountains and seas and rivers, O, mount, o monsters of the sea, and all things that move in the waters. O praise the Lord, and supremely exalt them unto the ages. Thou hast been revealed to be higher than the cherubim, O transcendently glorious Mary, birth giver of God. For in thy womb dwelt he whom we mortals together with the incorporeal hosts glorify unto all the ages. Bless the Lord, all ye winged creatures of the sky, O, o beasts and all cattle. O oh, praise the Lord, and supremely exalt him unto all the ages. Though I am set aflame with pleasures, and the vision of my soul is darkened of Christ, make me new with the fire of the fear of thee, and illuminate me with the light of salvation, that I may glorify thee unto all the ages. Bless the Lord, all ye, bless the Lord, all ye winged creatures of the sky, O beasts and all cattle, I praise you, Lord, and supremely exalt him unto the ages. O oh, my, lo <coughs> oh, my lowly soul, hate the satiety of the passions and feast. On the savory fare of good things, and delight rather the reveling of fasting, turning away from the bitterness of pleasures, and live unto the ages. 
Bless the Lord, ye sons of men, let Israel bless the Lord, we praise the Lord, and spring the exalted among the ages. Blinded in soul and darkened by the drunkenness of the passions, I can in no wise look unto thee, the, the only God. Wherefore, take pity on me and enlighten me and open unto me the gates of repentance. Bless the Lord, ye praise the Lord, ye servants of the Lord, I praise the Lord, and spring the exalted among the ages. O pure virgin who made us the heaven of our earth and an uncorrupted essence, through thy fervent intercession, make our prayers and supplications to be set forth before the Lord and King of thee and of us all. Bless the Lord, ye spirits, and ye souls of the righteous, ye saints, and all ye that be humble of heart, and praise the Lord, and supremely exalt him unto the ages. <coughs> let us radiantly receive the entry of the fast, O ye faithful, and let us not be of sad countenance, but let us wash our faces with the water of passionlessness, blessing and supremely exalting Christ unto all the ages. Bless the Lord, and Ananias, Azarias, and Misael, and praise the Lord, and supremely exalt him unto the ages. Anoint ye the head of our soul with the oil of compassion. Let us not speak with vain repetitions unto our Father which is in the heavens when we send our up prayers unto him, blessing and supremely exalting him unto all the ages. Bless the Lord, ye apostles, prophets, and martyrs of the Lord, who praise the Lord and supremely exalt him unto the ages. Let us praise the everlasting Father, which is without beginning, O ye faithful, and the jointly beginning, the Son, and the Spirit, who shone forth from the Father, the consubstantial persons, who are of one all-powerful sovereignty and authority. We bless Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, the Lord, and supremely exalt him unto the ages, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O Mary, who art called of God, thou art truly the mercy seat of the faithful, for from thee forgiveness is abundantly granted unto all. Cease not to propitiate thy Son and Lord for them that sing thy praise. Glory, glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. When the Lord fasted the measure of forty days, he consecrated and hallowed these present days, O ye brethren, coming whereunto we cry, Bless and supremely exalt Christ unto the ages. Praise, we bless, and we worship the Lord. <laughs> Let us praise the Lord, who of old we do the children of the Hebrews in their flame and past expectation, burned the Chaldeans therein. And let us say, bless and supremely exalt him unto all the ages. We look upon the lives of his handmaiden, for behold, from henceforth all generations shall call me blessed. More honorable than the cherubim, and beyond compare, more glorious than the seraphim. Thee who with a corruption and gave us birth to God the Word, the very Theotokos, thee do we magnify. O Tipisim Magalio Dinatos, que ai antono maftu, que tu elios of tu esgenian, que genian tis homenis afton, chesteisho yo cherubim, islavneisho yo besravneni a seraphim. Vesisenia Boga Slova Rosuyu, Sustuyu Boga Rodicu, Tia Velichaya. He shows strength with his army, as scared their power, the imagination of their heart. More honorable than the cherubim, and beyond compare, more glorious than the seraphim. Thee who with a corruption and gave us birth to God the Word, a very Theotokos, thee do we magnify. Kathila dinasus apotronon, ke ipsos etapinus, binonus and epis and agathon, ke plutundas, ex apestile kenus, dintimioter anton cheruvim. Quien doxotera nas ingritos son serafim, dina dia floros de on logon te cusan, tirondo se oto con se megalino me. With open a servant, as real remnants of his mercy, I speak to our fathers, to Abraham, and his seed forever. <coughs> More honorable than the cherubim, and beyond compare, more glorious than the seraphim. Thee who with a corruption and gave us birth to God the Word, the very Theotokos, thee do we magnify. For thou art God's mother, transcending mind and word, who ineffably in time gave us birth unto the timeless one, thee do, we thee do we the faithful magnify with one accord. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel, for he hath visited in our redemption for his people. 
Holy filled with immaterial longing, bowed this long to drink the cup of Christ, wherefore we all call thee blessed, O blessed Conan. And hath raised up a horn of salvation for us in the house of his servant David. Complying not with flatteries, but with the divine law in a manner pleasing to God, thou wholeheartedly drankest the cup of Christ, O blessed Conan. As he spake for the mouth of his holy ones, the prophets of old. Thou art the comeliness of the martyrs of glorious Conan, made comely with the most venerable marks of Christ. For this cause we all revere thee. That we should be saved from our enemies and from the hand of all that hate us. Since thou hast now obtained the inheritance in heaven, deliver me from the grievous calamities of life, O Conan, glorious athlete of the Lord. To deal mercifully with our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. Rejoice, O Theotokos, Mother of Christ, God, rejoice, thou holy mountain, rejoice, fountain, head of venerable virginity, rejoice, O Lady. The oath which he sware to our father Abraham, that he would grant unto us that we be delivered out of the hand of our enemies. Let the day of the fast be unto thee for the renunciation of sin, O my soul, and for both approaching unto God and making him thine, that thou mightest flee from the pits of wickedness and long for those paths alone that bring thee unto yonder rest. That we might serve him without fear and holiness and righteousness before him all the days of our life. Having both slipped in thoughts and sinned in the flesh, I lament and groan and cry, Save me, O Lord, save me, thou that alone art long-suffering, and condemn me not, who am worthy of condemnation to the fire of Gehenna yonder. Thou, child, shalt be called the prophet of the Most High, for thou shalt go before the face of the Lord to prepare his ways. Let us put on the light, like robe of fasting, and put off the dark and cumbersome raiment of debauchery. To give knowledge of salvation. Becoming ra- and becoming radiant with the divine virtues through faith, we shall behold the bright beaming passion of the Savior. To give knowledge of salvation unto his people by the remission of their sins through the bowels of mercy of our God. Heal my wretched soul, enfeebled by all the demons, wicked, wickedest assaults, O Immaculate Lady, who give his birth, give his birth to Christ, the physician and deliverer of us, who know thee, O Maid, to be an undefiled virgin. Whereby the day spring from on high hath visited us to give light to them that sit in darkness and in the shadow of death. Now has come the season of the Holy Fast. Let us make a good beginning thereof by a good way of life, for it is said, Fear not unto condemnation and to strife. Fast. Now is come the, the season of the Holy Fast. Let us make a beginning thereof by a good way of life, for it is said, Fast not unto condemnation and to strife. To guide our feet into the way of peace. Elias, cleansed by fasting, saw God on Mount Horeb. Let us also be cleansed in heart by fasting, and we shall see Christ. Both Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. I worship one nature, I am three persons, one, fa- one God of all the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, the everlasting sovereignty. Both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages, amen. Thou the pure bearest the child, thou the virgin sucklest at the breast, how can both at the same time, how can both be at the same time, that having given birth thou art a virgin? It is God that hath accomplished it, seek not of me how it has come to pass. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. One day it is said, <coughs> is the whole life of the earth born. For them that labor with longing, there are forty days of the fast, the which let us accomplish with joy. Mm-hmm. O thou who art God's mother, transcending mind and word, who ineffably in time gave us birth unto the timeless one, thee do we the faithful magnify with one accord. Axiones dinos alithos, makaris in setting theoto ocon, in ai makaris on ke panamomito, in ke mitero tu theuimon. Tin timioter and un cherubim, ke nuxotera na singritus un serafim, tin adi aftoros theonogon de kusan, in ondos theoto con se megalino me. Pues theotokos sevas. I get in again in peace. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by the Lord grace. Lord have mercy. Calling to remembrance our holy Mac, the most Lord blessed. Holy is it, O Lord, save us. Let us commit ourselves to one another and all our life unto Christ our God. To the Lord. For all the hosts of the heavens, praise thee, and unto thee do we send up glory. To the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Since thou art light, O Christ, enlighten me in thee. By the protection of the body, this host, O Lord, and save me. 
Since Thou art light, O Christ, enlighten me in Thee by the intercessions of the Hierarch, O Lord, and save me. Since Thou art light, O Christ, enlighten me in Thee by the intercessions of the Theotokos, O Lord, and save me. Τη δόξα πρέπει πρέπει κύριο Θεός ημών και εσύ τη δόξα με πέμπε το Πατρί και το Υιό και το Υιό Πνεύμα την Ινκή και έχεις όνος των αιώνων. Αμήν. Glory to God in the highest on earth, peace, good will towards men. We praise thee, be blessed, be worshipped, be glorified, we give thanks thee for thy great glory. O Lord, heaven and King, God the Father Almighty, O Lord, the only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. O Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, that takes away the sin of the world, have mercy on us, thou that takes away the sin of the world. Receive our prayer, thou that sits at the right hand of the Father, and have mercy on us. The only art holy, the only art the Lord Jesus Christ, to the glory of God the Father. Amen. Every day will I bless thee and I praise thy name forever, yea, forever and ever. Lord, thou hast been a refuge from generation to, gener to generation. I say, Lord, have mercy on me, heal my soul, for I have sinned against thee. Lord, unto thee I have fled for refuge. Teach me to do the will of thou art my God. For thee is the fountain of life, and thy life shall be seed life. O continue thy mercy unto them that know thee. Vow say for Lord to keep us this day without sin. Blessed art thou, Lord, the God of our fathers. And praise and glorify us in the name of the ages. Amen. Let thy mercy, Lord, be upon us according as we have hoped in thee. Blessed art thou, Lord, teach me thy statutes. Blessed art thou, Master, grant me understanding of thy statutes. Blessed art thou, Holy One, enlightened by thy statutes. O Lord, the mercy endureth forever, disdain not the works of thy hands. Unto thee is due praise, unto thee is due song, unto thee glory is due, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever into the ages of ages. Amen. Let us complete our morning prayer unto the Lord. Lord have mercy. <coughs> Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by the grace. Lord have mercy. That the whole day may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless. Let us ask Grant the Lord, this Lord soul. peace of faithful God, a guardian of our souls and bodies. Let us ask Grant the Lord, this pardon and remission of our sins and offenses. Let us ask the Lord, this good and profitable for our souls and peace for the world. Let us ask the Lord, this soul. that we complete the remaining time of our life in peace and repentance. Let us ask Grant the Lord, this Christian ending to our life, painless, blameless, peaceful, and a good defense before the dread judgment seat of Christ. Let us ask Grant the Lord, this soul. calling to remembrance for all holy Mac, the most blessed Lord. Lord, save us, and all our life, unto Christ our to God. The Lord. Lord God, of mercy and compassion, and love for man art thou, and unto thee we send a glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, thou endeavor unto the ages of ages. Amen. Peace be unto all. And to thy Spirit. Let us bow our heads unto the Lord. For thine it is to have mercy and to save us, Lord God, and unto thee do we send up glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Amen. The past is come, the mother of sobriety, the accuser of sin, the advocate of repentance, the state of angels and the salvation of men. O ye faithful, let us cry, O God, have mercy on us. We were filled in the morning with thy mercy, O Lord, and we rejoice and we're glad in all our days. Let us be glad for the days when thou dost humble us. For the years when we saw evils, and look upon thy servants, and upon thy works, and do thou guide their sons. <clears throat> the fast is come, the mother of his sobriety, the accuser of sin, the advocate of repentance, the state of angels, and the salvation of men. <clears throat> O ye faithful, let us cry, O God, have mercy on us. And then let the bright
brightness of the Lord our God be upon us, and the works of our hands do thou guide or right upon us. Yea, the works of our hands do thou guide or right. Blessed is the army of the King of the heavens, for though the prize winners were born of earth, yet they eagerly strove to attain to the angelic reign by to the angelic rank by disdaining their bodies and through their sufferings they were counted worthy of the honor of the bodiless hosts by their prayers O Lord send down thy great mercy unto us Glory to the Father and to the Son and the Holy Spirit both now and ever and unto the angels of so angels Amen with voices of song we magnify thee, the Mother of God and pure Virgin, who art more holy than the cherubim, for we confess thee to be the Theotokos in body and soul, since thou literally gavest birth to God incarnate, intercede, O all pure, in behalf of our soul. It is good to give praise unto the Lord and to chant unto the name most high to proclaim in the morning thy mercy and thy truth by night. Peace, beloved, the despot, our holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, and mercy on us, holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, and mercy on us, holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, and mercy on us, the glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and under the ages of ages. Amen. All holy Trinity, have mercy on us, O Lord, be gracious unto our sins, master, pardon our iniquities, holy one, visit and heal our infirmities, for the name's sake. O Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and under the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. As we stand in the, in the temple of thy glory, we reckon ourselves to be standing in heaven with Theotokos, so heaven the gate. Open unto us the portal of thy mercy. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord Thee, who without corruption gave his birth to God the Word, the very Theotokos, did to magnify. In the name of the Lord, Master, bless. Blessed to see that he is in Christ, such a God, always not over to the age of ages. Amen. O heavenly King, make steadfast our sacred sin and establish the faith, subdue the nations, give peace to the world, guard well the sacred monastery and town. Appoint to our fathers and brethren who are gone before us a place for the tabernacles of the just and acceptance and repentance and confession, since thou art good and the friend of man. <coughs> Lord and Master of my life, a spirit of idleness, curiosity, ambition, and idle talk, give me not. But a spirit of chastity, humility, patience, and love bestow upon me thy servant. <coughs> you, o Lord King, grant me to see my own failings, and not to condemn my brother, for blessed are thou unto the ages of ages. O God, be gracious unto me, sir. 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 God, be gracious unto me, sir. God, be gracious unto me, sir. Ye, O Lord King, grant me to see my own failings, and not to condemn my brother, for blessed are thou unto the ages of ages. Amen. O come, let us worship, and fall down before our King God. O come, let us worship, and fall down before Christ our King God. O come, let us worship and fall down before him, Christ the King and our God.
words to thee, O Lord, hear my cry, to the voice of my supplication, my King, my God, for unto thee will I pray, O Lord, in the morning shall I hear my voice, in the morning shall I stand before thee, and I shall look upon me, for not the God of this iniquity art thou. He that worketh evil shall not dwell near thee, nor shall transgressor divide before thine eyes. Thou hast hated all them that work iniquity, thou shalt destroy them, and speak a lie, man is bloody and deceitful, so the Lord of four that is for me, and the multitude of thy mercy shall I go into thy house, I shall worship towards thy holy temple, and fear thee. O Lord, guide me in the way of thy righteousness, because of mine enemies make straight my way before thee. For in their mouth there is no truth, their heart is vain, their throat is an open sepulchre, with their tongues and they spoken deceitfully, judge them, O God. Let them fall down on account of their own devisings, according to the multitude of their ungodliness, cast them out, for they have embittered thee, O Lord, and let all them be glad at hope in thee, they shall ever rejoice, and thou shalt dwell among them, and also glory in thee, that love thy name, for thou shalt bless the righteous, O Lord, is with the shield of thy good pleasure, as I crown us. Lord, thou hast been our refuge in generation and generation before the mountains gained thee, and the earth was formed. In the world, even from everlasting to everlasting, thou art, turn that man away unto lowliness, yea, thou hast said, turn back, ye sons of men, for a thousand years in thine eyes, O Lord, of what is yesterday, that is past, and as a watch in the night, things of no account, shall the years be in the morning, like grass, and man pass away in the evening, shall he fall in the, in the morning, shall he bloom and pass away, in the evening, shall he fall and grow with it and dry, for we have fainted away in thy wrath, and in thy anger have we been troubled, thou said our iniquities before thee, our lifespan is enlightened, thy countenance, for all our days are faded away, and in thy wrath we fainted away, our years like a spider has out their tail. As for the days of our years and our span of three score years and ten, and if we be in strength, may have four score years, and what is more than these, this toil and travail. For mildness has come upon us, and we should be chastened, who knoweth the might of thy wrath, and not a fear of thee, who could recount thine anger, shall make thy right hand known to me, and to them in a harder instruction of wisdom. Return, O Lord, how long and be thou entreated concerning thy servants who are filled in the morning with thy mercy, O Lord, and we rejoice and we are glad in all our days. Let us be glad for the days when thou dost humble us for the years when we saw evils and look upon thy servants and upon thy works. If thou guide their sons and not the brightness of the Lord our God be upon us and the works of our hands, if thou guide her right upon us, see the work of our hands, if thou guide her right of mercy and judgment will I sing unto thee, O Lord, I will chant and have understanding and a blameless path. When will they come unto me? I have walked in the innocence of my heart in the midst of my house, so I have no unlawful thing before mine eyes. The workers of transgressions I have hated. A crooked art have not cleaved unto me, as for the wicked man who turned from me, I knew him not, him that fearfully talked against his neighbor, did I drive away from me, with him as I was proud and his heart and satiated, I did not eat mine eyes, were upon the faithful of the land, that they might sit with me. The man that walked in the blameless path, and ministered unto me, the proud doer dwelt not in the midst of my house, the speaker of unjust things, prospered not before mine eyes, in the morning I slew all the sinners of the land, utterly destroy of the city of the Lord, all the network iniquity. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now, and ever, and unto the age of the Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. To praise Agus and his holiness, move as he lets, move out the Unto my words give ear, O Lord, hear my cry. In the morning hearken unto my voice, O my King and my God. For unto thee will I pray, O Lord. In the morning hearken unto my voice, O my King and my God. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now and unto the ages of ages, amen. What shall we call thee, O full of grace, heaven, for thou hast made the Son of righteousness, and on forth paradise, for thou hast brought forth the flower of immortality, virgin, for thou hast remained in corrupt, your mother, for thou hast held in thy holy embrace, the Son, who is the God of all, do thou entreat him to save our souls. Tadia vimata mukatefti non katato logi onsu ke mi kata kiriev sato mu pasano mia. My steps do thou direct according to thy saying, and let no iniquity have dominion over me. Little seme aposiko pandi as anthropon ke pilak sota sendo lasu. Deliver me from the false accusation of man, and I will keep thy commandments. To prosopon su epifano ne piton do lonsu ke Make thy faces shine upon thy servant and teach me thy statue. Let my mouth be filled with thy praise, O Lord, that I make him thy glory and thy majesty all the day long. Let my mouth be filled with thy praise, O Lord, that I make him thy glory and thy majesty all the day long. 
light in us for the Holy God, holy mercy, 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 our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Thy is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, and ever unto the ages of ages. Amen. With heart and mouth, let us continually praise the supremely glorious Mother of God, who is holier than the, hall, than the holy angels, as we confess her to be the Theotokos, for she barely gave birth unto God in the flesh. And she interceded continually in behalf of our souls. Lord of mercy, 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 Thou would all times and at every hour in heaven and on earth have worshipped and glorified, O Christ God, who are long suffering, plenteous of mercy, most compassionate, who loves the righteousness, mercy, and sinners, who call us all to salvation through the promise of good things to come. Receive, O Lord, our prayers for this hour and guard our life towards the commandments, sanctify our souls, make chaste our bodies, correct our thoughts, purify our intentions, and deliver us from every sorrow, evil, and pain. Compass us about with the holy angels, like I did, and guard by their ray, may it seem to the unity, the faith, and knowledge of thine unapproachable glory. Blessed are thou unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now, and never unto the ages of ages, men, more honorable than the cherubim, be I compare more grace, and a seraphim, be God of corruption, give us word to God, the word, the very thought, the seed, we magnify, in the name of the Lord, Master, bless. Bless and bless us, and cause his face to shine upon us, in mercy, and mercy. Amen. Kyrie kedas, hodot di zoiz, mu pnei margias, periargias, filarchias, kergologias, mimidos. Πνεύμα δε σοφροσύνης, ταπεινοφροσύνης, υπομονής και αγάπης, χάρισε με το Σοδούλο. Ναι, Κύριε Βασιλέα, φωτορήσε με το ράντα μα πτέσματα και μη κατακρίνει τον αρφό μου, ότι ευλογητώσεις τους αιώνας των αιώνων. God be gracious unto me, sir. Oh God be gracious unto me, sir. Oh God be gracious unto me, sir. O 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 God be gracious unto me, sir. Have mercy. You, O Lord King, grant me to see my unfailings, and not to condemn my brother, for blessed are thou to the ages of ages. Amen. O Christ, the true light, who does enlighten the saints forever, may the peaceful light of despot, O Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal mercy in us, holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal mercy in us, holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal mercy in us, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now, and ever, and unto the ages of ages, amen, O Holy Trinity, have mercy in us, Lord, be your sister, and our sins, master, pardon our iniquities, holy one, the sitting, heal and for the name's sake, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and unto the Holy Spirit, but now, and ever, and unto the ages of ages, amen. Our Father, which art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. That cometh into the world, that the light of the count is beside upon us that in it we may behold an approachable light and guide our steps in the performance of thy commandments by the intercessions of thine Almighty Mother of all thy saints. Of the Boroskinism 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 of the Hearken, O God, unto my righteousness, and unto my supplication, give ear unto my prayer, which cometh not from deceitful lips, from before their face, let my judgment come forth, on my eyes, behold, uprightness, and prove my heart, those visit it in the night, 
I was driving by fire and unrighteousness was not found in me, that my mouth might not speak of the works of men for the sake of the words of thy lips, if I kept the ways that are hard, set my footsteps in thy paths, and my steps may not be shaken, I have pride, for thou hast hearkened unto me, O God, inclining near to me, and hearkened unto my words, that thy mercies be made wonderful, O thou that savest them, I hope in thee from them that have resisted thy right hand, keep me, O Lord, as the apple of thine eye. And the shelter of thy wings, for thou shelter me from the face of the ungodly which have oppressed me. Mine enemies have surrounded my soul, they have enclosed themselves with their own fat, their mouth has spoken pride. They that cast me out of now and circle me, they have set their eyes to look askance on the earth. They have taken me as mine lion, ready for his prey, and as mine alliance, both of wealth and hiding. Arise, O Lord, overtake them and trip their heels. Deliver my soul from ungodly men, thy sword from the enemies in thy hand. O Lord, from thy feet, do thou separate them from the earth and their life. Yea, with thy hidden treasures have their belly been filled. They have satisfied themselves with spine of the remnants to their babes. But as for me in righteousness, shall I appear before the face that should be filled when the glory is made manifest to me. And to thee, O Lord, have I lifted up my soul to my God, and thee have I trusted. Let me never be put to shame, nor let mine enemies not be to scorn. Yea, let none that wait on thee be put to shame. Let them be ashamed, for which are lawless without a cause. Make thy ways, O Lord, known unto me, and teach me thy paths. Lead me in thy truth, and teach me, for thou art God my Savior. For in thee have I waited all the day long. Remember thy compassions, O Lord, and thy mercies, for they are from everlasting. The sins of my youth and my ignorance is remember not according to thy mercy. Remember thou me for the sake of thy goodness, O Lord. Good and upright is the Lord, therefore will they set a law from them, a sin and a way. He will guide to make a judgment, he will teach to make his ways. All the ways of the Lord are mercy and truth unto them, and seek others' covenant and his testimonies for the sake of thy name. O Lord, be gracious unto my sin, for it is great. Who is a man that feareth the Lord, who he will set him along the way which he hath chosen, his soul shall dwell among good things, and his seat shall inherit the earth. The Lord is the strength of them, I fear him, and his covenant shall be manifested unto them. My eyes are ever toward the Lord, for he it is, I will draw my feet out of the snare. Look upon me and have mercy on me, for I am one, only begotten and poor. The afflictions of my heart are multiplying, bring me out from my necessities. Behold my lowliness, my toil, and forgive all my sins. Look upon my enemies, for they are multiplied, and with an unjust feeder that they heated me. Keep my soul, and rescue me, let me not be put to shame, for I have hoped in thee. The innocent and the upright have cleaved unto me, for I have waited on thee, O Lord, redeem Israel, O God, out of all his afflictions. Have mercy on me, O God, according to thy great mercy, and according to the multitude of thy compassions. Blood of my transgression, wash me thoroughly from my iniquity, and cleanse me from my sin. For I know mine iniquity of my sin is over before me against thee, only have I sinned and done this evil before thee, that the mightiest be justified in their words and fulfilled in their judge. For behold, I was conceived in iniquities, and the sins of my mother bear me. For behold, I was loved truth, the hidden and sacred things, the wisdom of made manifest unto me. Thou shalt sprinkle me with hyssop, and I shall be made clean. Thou shalt wash me, and I shall be made whiter than snow. Thou shalt make me to hear joy and gladness, the bones to be humble, they shall rejoice. Turn thy face away from my sins, and blot off all mine iniquities. Create in me a clean heart of God, and renew thy spirit within me. Cast me not away from thy presence, and take not thy Holy Spirit from me. Restore to me the joy of thy salvation, and with a governing spirit of salvation me, I shall teach transgressors thy ways, and the ungodly shall turn back unto thee, deliver me from blood guiltiness of God, the God of my salvation, my tongue shall rejoice in thy righteousness. O Lord, thou shalt open my lips, and my mouth shall declare thy praise, for thou hast desired sacrifice, I given it with a burnt offering, so shall not be pleased. The sacrifice and the God is a broken spirit, a heart that is broken, a humble God will not despise. Do good, O Lord, and make a pleasure on the sign, and let the walls of Jerusalem be builded, then shall it be pleased with the sacrifice of righteousness, with the palatial home burnt offering, so shall the offer be upon thine altar. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, for now, and ever, and unto the ages of Israel. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to Jesus Christ, and God. Jesus Christ, and God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and of God, have mercy me. 
Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and to these of these, amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to your God. Alleluia, 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 glory to your God. Alleluia, 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 glory to your God. I hope the Lord, glory be to το Παναγιο σου πνεύμα εν τη τρίτη ώρα της Αποστολής σου καταπέμψας του το αγαθέ μη αντανέλης αφημών αλλά εν κέρυσον ημιν της δεωμένης σου. Create me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. O Lord, who at the third hour did send down thine all Holy Spirit upon thine apostles, take not him from us, O good one, but renew him in us who pray unto thee. Cast me away from thy presence and take not thy Holy Spirit from me. O Lord, who at the third hour did send down thine all Holy Spirit upon thine apostles, Take not him from us, O good one, but renew him in us, who pray unto thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, for now, and ever and unto the ages of ages, amen. For the took us our to two vine that blossom forth for us the fruit of life, thee do we supplicate and intercede. O Lady, together with the apostles and all the saints, that our souls find mercy. Blessed is the Lord God, blessed is the Lord day by day, the God of our salvation, so prosperous along the way. Our God is the God of salvation. He's for light, it is for the for the God, for the mighty, for the mortal mercy in us, for the God, for the mighty, for the mortal mercy in us, for the God, for the mighty, for the mortal mercy in us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, for now and ever unto the ages of ages, amen, O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us, Lord, be gracious in our sins, Master, pardon our iniquities, holy one, for the name of the for the name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, for now and ever unto the ages of ages, amen. Our Father, which art in heaven, to love be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven, give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors, and lead us unto temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Blessed art thou, Christ, our God, who has shown forth the fishermen as supreme and wise by sending down upon them the Holy Spirit, and through them destroy the world into thy net, O Befender of man, glory be to thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, grant thou speedy and lasting consolation unto thy servants, O Jesus, when our souls are despondent. Be thou not parted from our souls when they be afflictions, but be thou not be thou not far from our minds when we are in perils, but 
do thou ever anticipate our needs, draw nigh unto us, draw nigh out, thou who art everywhere present, and even as thou art ever with thine apostles, thus do thou also unite unto thyself us who long for thee, O compassionate one, that being united with thee, we may praise and glorify thine all holy spirit, both now and ever unto the ages of ages of men. The hope and protection and refuge of Christians, the unassailable battle of the storms, free haven of the weary art thou, O Immaculate Theotokos, but as thou savest the world by thine unceasing intercession to remember us also all him virgin lord of mercy 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 Thou who at all times and at every hour, even on earth, the worship and glory, for Christ God, our long suffering, plenty of sinners, sing most compassionate, who love us to righteousness, mercy and sinners, who call us all to salvation, to the promise of good things to come. Receive, O Lord, our prayers to this hour, and guide our life towards the commandments, sanctify our souls, make taste our bodies, correct our thoughts, purify our intentions, and deliver us from every sorrow, evil, and pain. Compass us about the holy angels, like I did, and guarded by their ray, may it seem to the unity, the faith, and the knowledge of thine unapportable glory, from blessed are thou unto the ages of ages, amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, for now and ever unto the ages of ages, amen. More honorable than the cherubim, beyond him, more glorious than the seraphim, thee without corruption, gave us birth to God, the word, the very theatre, because we magnify in the name of the Lord, Master Blood. The first victory is a mask, if you say, mask, if you find the first one, if you mask, you lay, say, mask. O Lord and Master of my life, a spirit of idleness, curiosity, ambition, and idle talk, give me not. <clears throat> but a spirit of chastity, humility, patience, and love bestow upon me thy servant. Yea, O Lord King, grant me to see my own failings, and not to condemn my brother, for blessed are thou to the ages of ages. O oh God, be gracious unto me, sinner. 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 O God, be gracious unto me, sinner. O oh God, be gracious unto me, sinner. O oh God, be gracious unto me, sinner. O oh God, be gracious unto me, sinner. Have mercy. Ye, O Lord King, grant me to see my own failings, and not to condemn my brother. For blessed are thou unto the ages of ages. Amen. O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us, Lord, be gracious in our sins, Master, pardon our iniquities, Lord, and this is any healing from these for their namesake. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now and the unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, which art in heaven, tell be thy name, thy kingdom come, and thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil. Amen. The kingdom of the power and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Now and ever unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy, God the Father Almighty, O Lord, the only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, and thou, Holy Spirit. One God had one power, and mercy me, sinner, and by the judgment which thou knowest, save me, that I worthy servant, for blessed are thou unto the ages of ages. Amen. O come, let us worship and fall down before our King God. O come, let us worship and fall down before Christ, our King and God. O come, let us worship and fall down before Him, Christ, the King and God. <coughs> o God, in thy name, save me, and in thy strength, do thou judge me, O God, hearken to my prayer, give ear unto the words of my mouth, for strangers are risen up against me, mighty men have sought over my soul, and that God before themselves, for behold, God helpeth me, and the Lord is the protector of my soul. He will bring evils upon mine enemies, utterly destroy them by the truth of me, shall I sacrifice unto thee. I will confess thy name, O Lord, for it is good, for out of every affliction as thou deliver me, my eyes look down upon mine enemies. Give ear, O God, unto my prayer, and disdain at my supplication, attend to me, and hear me. I was grieved in my meditation, I was troubled at the voice of the enemy, of the oppression of the sinner, because they have turned iniquity upon me, and wrath with their anger against me. My heart is troubled within me, and a terror of death has fallen upon me, fear and trembling are come upon me. In darkness I covered me, and I said, Who will give me wings like a dove, and I'll find be at rest? Lo, I have fled afar off, and have dwelt in the wilderness. I waited for God that saveth me from faint-heartedness from, and from tempest. Plunge them into the depths of the Lord, and divide their tongues, for I have seen iniquity and gain, saying in the city, 
Day and night they go round about her upon her walls, in equity and toil, and unrighteousness, or in the midst of her, and usury and deceit of another part of her streets. For if my enemy had reviled me, I might have endured it, and feared that it heeded me, had spoken boastful words against me, I might have fit myself from him, but thou it was, and man of like soul with me, my guide and my familiar friend. Now who, together with me, this week to my repast, in the house of God, I walk with thee in oneness of mine. Let death come upon such ones, and let her go down, and let into Hades, for wickedness is in her dwellings, and in the midst of them is for me, and a God of I cried, and the Lord hearken unto me, evening, morning, and noonday, will I tell of it, and I will declare it, and he will hear my voice, he will redeem my soul in peace. From them that draw nigh to me, for they among many were with me, God will hear, and he will humble them, he that is before the ages, for therein there is no requital, because they have not feared God. He stretched forth his hand at retribution, they have defiled his covenant, they were scattered by the wrath of his countenance, and their hearts are convened. The words are smoother, nor they yet their darts, cast their care upon the Lord, and he will nourish thee. He will never permit the righteous to be shaken, but thou, O God, shall bring those men down into the pit of destruction. Bloody and deceitful men shall not, shall not, nev, shall not live out half their days, but as for me, O Lord, I will help in thee. He that dwelleth in the help of the Most High shall abide in the shelter of the God of heaven. He shall say unto the Lord, Thou art my helper, my refuge. He is my God, and I will hope in him. For he shall deliver thee from the snare of the hunters and from every troubling word. With his shoulders shall they overshadow thee, and under his wings shall thou have hope. With the shield of this truth encompass thee. Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that flyeth by day, nor for the thing that walketh in darkness, nor for the mist of and demon and noonday. A thousand shall fall at thy side, and ten thousand at thy right hand, but unto thee shall I not come nigh. Only with thine eyes shall thou behold, and thou shalt see the reward of sinners, for thou, Lord, art my hope. Thou madest the most high thy refuge, no evil shall come nigh thee, and no scourge shall draw nigh to thy dwelling. For he shall give his angels charge over thee to keep thee in all thy ways. On their hands shall they bear thee up, lest at any time thou shalt foot against the stone. Upon the aspen basket thou shalt thou tread, and thou shalt trample upon the lion and dragon. For he has set his hope on me, and I will deliver him. I will shelter him, because he hath known my name. He shall cry unto me, and I will hearken unto him. I am with him in affliction. I will rescue him and glorify him. With length of days will I satisfy him, and I will show him my salvation. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. But now, and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Um, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy. Lord Jesus Christ, O God, have mercy. Lord Jesus Christ, O God, have mercy. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy. Me, Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy. Me, Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy. Me, Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy. Me, Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy. Me, Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy. Me, Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy. Me, Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy. Me, Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy. Me, Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy. Me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. 
<coughs> Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God of mercy me, Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God of mercy me, Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God of mercy me. <coughs> Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God of mercy me, Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God of mercy me, Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God of mercy me. <coughs> Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and oh God, have mercy me, sinner. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both down up to the age of age. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to your God. Alleluia, 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 glory to your God. Alleluia, 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 glory to your God. Our hope, O Lord, glory be to thee. Μέρατε και ώρα το σταυρό προσιλώσα στην έντο παραδείσο των μυθίσαν το δάμα μαρτία και των δεσμάτων ημών το χειρόγραφο διάρρηξαν Χριστέ ο Θεός και σώσον ημάς. Give ye, O God, unto my prayer and disdain. Give ear, O God, unto my prayer and disdain not my supplication. Thou who on the sixth day and at the sixth hour didst nail to the cross the sin that Adam dared to commit in paradise, tear up also the handwriting of our offenses, O Christ God, and save us. Unto God have I cried, and the Lord hearkened unto me. Thou who on the sixth day and the sixth hour didst nail to the cross the sin that Adam dared to commit in paradise, tear up also the handwriting of our offenses, O Christ God, and save us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, for now and of none to the ages of ages. Amen. Seeing that we have no golden son, I can have many sins who have him that was born in the over ten theotokos for the supplication of a mother, availeth much and win a master's favor, disdain not to perish the sinners who most august one from her please he and mighty to save he the deigned to suffer for our sake. Mm-hmm. Lord, O oh Lord, at whom all things quake and tremble before the face of thy power, before thee do we fall down, no immortal one. Thee do we pray, O Holy One, save our souls by the intercessions of thy saints. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Both now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. O Lord, O Lord, at whom all things quake and tremble, before the face of thy power, before thee do we fall down, O Immortal One. Thee do we pray, O Holy One, save our souls by the intercessions of thy saints. Prokimenon, fourth tone, Psalm 1. The Lord knows the way of the righteous, and the way of the ungodly shall perish. The Lord knoweth the way of the righteous, and the way of the ungodly shall perish. The Lord knoweth the way of the righteous, and the way of the ungodly shall perish. Blessed is the man that hath not walked in the counsel of the ungodly. The Lord knoweth the way of the righteous. And the way of the ungodly shall perish. The reason the prophecy of Isaiah. The vision which Isaiah, the son of Amos, saw, which he saw against Judah and against Jerusalem in the reign of Ozias and Joatham and Ahaz and Hezekiah, who were kings of Judea. Hear, O heaven, and give ear, O earth, for the Lord hath spoken. I have begotten and brought up children, but they have rejected me. The ox knoweth his owner, and the ass his master's crib, but Israel knoweth me not and my people considereth me not. Woe, sinful nation, a people full of sins, an evil seed, lawless sons, ye have forsaken the Lord and provoked the Holy One of Israel. Why should he be smitten any more 
adding iniquity more and more. The whole head is in pain and the whole heart in grief. From the feet to the head there is no soundness in it, neither wound nor bruise nor putrefying sore hath a plaster to be applied to it, nor ointment nor bandages. Your land is desolate, your cities burned with fire, your country, strangers devour it in your presence, and it is made desolate, overthrown by strange peoples. The daughter of Sion shall be left as a tent in a vineyard and as a hut of an orchard keeper in a garden of cucumbers in a besieged city. And except the Lord of Saboth had left us a seed, we had been as Sodom and been made like unto Gomorrah. Hear the word of the Lord, ye rulers of Sodom. Attend to the law of God, thou people of Gomorrah. What to me is the multitude of your sacrifices, saith the Lord? I am full of whole burnt offerings of rams and the fat of lambs, and I have no pleasure in the blood of bulls and he goats. Neither shall he come to appear before me, for who hath required these things at your hands? Tread my court no more, though he bring me the finest wheat and flour, it is in vain. Incense is an abomination to me. Your new moons and your Sabbaths are the great day. I cannot endure your fasting and rest from work and your feasts. My soul hateth. I have had enough of you. I can bear your sins no longer. When he stretch forth your hands unto me, I will turn my eyes away from you. And though we multiply your prayer, I will not hearken to you, for your hands are full of blood. Wash you, make ye clean, put away the evils from your souls before mine eyes, and cease to do your evils, learn to do what is good, seek judgment, deliver him that is wronged, execute judgment for the fatherless, plead for the widow, and come, let us reason together, saith the Lord. And though your skin, sins be as scarlet, I will make them white as snow, and though they be as crimson, I will make them white as wool. And if ye be willing and hearken unto me, ye shall eat the good of the land. But if ye be not willing, neither hearken to me, the sword shall devour you, for the mouth of the Lord hath spoken it. Prochemenon, grave tone, Psalm 2. Serve ye the Lord with fear, and rejoice in him with trembling. Serve ye the Lord with fear, and rejoice in him with trembling. Serve ye the Lord with fear, and rejoice in him with trembling. Why have the heathen raged, and the peoples meditated empty things? Serve ye the Lord with fear, and rejoice in him with trembling. Let the compassions quickly go before us, O Lord, for we are become exceedingly poor. Help us, O God, our Savior, for the sake of the glory of thy name. O Lord, deliver us and be gracious and our sins, for thy name's sake, to light us for all. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal mercy in us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal mercy in us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal mercy in us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now and to the to the age of the men. O Holy Trinity, have mercy in us, Lord, be gracious and our sins, Master, pardon our iniquities, holy one, the fifth, and healing from grace for the name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now and to the age of the men. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil. And <coughs> Amen. Thou hast wrought salvation in the midst of the earth, O Christ God. Thou dost stretch out thine immaculate hands upon the cross, thereby gathering all nations that cry to thee, O Lord. Glory be to thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. We worship thine immaculate icon, O good one, asking, asking the forgiveness of our failings. For, O, o Christ our God, for, our, for of thy own will, thou wast well pleased to us in the cross and the flesh, that thou mightest deliver from slavery to the enemy those whom thou hast fashioned. Wherefore, we cry to thee thankfully. Thou dost fill all things with joy, O our Savior, when thou camest to save the world. Both now and ever unto the ages of ages of men, since thou art a wellspring of pity, count us worthy of compassion, O Theotokos, look upon thy sinful people, and show forth, as always, thy power. For hoping in thee, we cry, rejoice unto thee, as once did Gabriel, the supreme commander of the bodiless hosts. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy,
Thou art all things in it every hour, and heaven on earth, the worship and glorified our Christ God, our long suffering, plenteous of mercy, most compassionate, and love is to righteousness, mercy, and sinners, to call us all to salvation through the promise of good things to come. Receive the Lord our prayers of this hour, and guide our life towards our commandments. Sanctify our souls, make chaste our bodies, correct our thoughts, purify our intentions, and deliver us from every sorrow, evil, and pain. Compass us about with the holy angels, that guide and guard over their ray, may it seem to the unity of the faith and the knowledge of thine own political glory. Blessed art thou unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now and ever unto the ages of ages. Amen. The more nominable than the cherubim, and beyond compare more glorious than the seraphim, thee without corruption, give us with the God the word, the very theotokos, see that we magnify in the name of the Lord. Master bless. The first thing that you say, Mask, if you say, Mask, if you find the Buddha's wife, if you ask, if you say, Mask, Kiria Kedas, what the disease, Mubna Margias, Periargias, Philarchias, Kiargologias, Mimidos. Πνεύμα δε σοφροσύνη, ταπεινοφροσύνη, υπομονή και αγάπη, χάρη σε με το σοδούλο. <coughs> ναι, κύριε Βασιλεύ, δωρησέ μου, το ωράντε μάπτεσματα <coughs> και μη κατακρίνει τον αδελφόν μου, ότι βλογητώ εσύ του αιώνα των αιώνων. Ο Θεό ελάστι με το μαρτυρό, ο Θεό ελάστι με το μαρτυρό. Ο Θεός ελάσσι τη με τον Μαρτωρό. God be gracious unto me, Son. 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 Our mercy. Yeah, O Lord King, grant me to see my own failings and not to condemn my brother. For blessed are thou unto the ages of ages. Amen. He's flyer to this, but all for the God for the mighty, holy, mortal mercy in us. For the God for the mighty, holy, mortal mercy in us. For the God for the mighty, holy, mortal mercy in us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now and ever unto you, the ages of ages, men. All holy trinity have mercy in us, Lord, bigger us in our sins, master, pardon our iniquities, holy ones, and heal our infirmities for the name's sake, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now and ever and unto the ages of ages, men. Our Father, which art in heaven, holy be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. O God, Lord of hosts, the maker of all creation, who with the tender compassion of thine unfathomable mercy did send down the only begotten Son of the Lord Jesus Christ of the salvation of our race. And by his precious cross, this terrible handwriting of our sins, and thereby this triumph over the principalities and powers of darkness. <coughs> Do thou thyself a man for any mass, except also from our sinners, these prayers of thanksgiving and entreaty, and deliver us from every destructive and dark transgression, and from all enemies, both invisible and invisible, that seek to do us evil. Nail down our flesh with the fear of thee, and incline not our hearts unto words or thoughts of evil, but pierce our souls with longing for thee, so that our looking to thee and being guided by thy light. As we behold thee, then approach from everlasting light. We may send up unceasing praise and thanksgiving unto thee, the Father, which we are beginning with our own begotten Son, and all holy, good, and life bringing Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Glory to thee, O Christ, our God, our hope. Glory to thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, holy Master, bless. Christ, our true God, by the intercessions of His all immaculate and all blameless Holy Mother, by the power of the only life giving cross, by the protection of the venerable heavenly body, this power is by the supplications. Of the venerable, glorious prophet, forerunner, and Baptist John, of the holy, glorious, and of him, the apostles, Peter and Paul, the chiefs of twelve and the seventy, of our father among the saints, Nicholas and Mary and Alicia, of the holy, glorious, great martyrs, George and Trophy, Bear, Demetrius, the mercy streaming of the holy, glorious, and triumphantly victorious martyrs, of our righteous and God bearing fathers, Clement and Noam, of Ocrid, the wonder workers, Sarah from Osra, from of Alaska, and Santa Juvenalia of Alaska, Tikon, the confessor, Page, Jerko Moscow, Peter the Eliud, our fathers among the saints, new confessors, Filler of New York, the Carrie of Romania, and Chrysostom of Florina. Of her righteous mothers, <coughs> Xenia and Teresia, the fools for Christ's sake, of our holy patron John Maximovich, Archbishop of San Francisco, the wonder worker of the holy and righteous ancestors of God, Joachim and Anna, of the holy righteous martyr Conan of Hesoria, and his fellow martyr Nessius, our righteous father Mark the Ascetic, the wonder worker, and our righteous father Nicholas Filimirovich, whose memory we keep. And of all the saints, may have mercy on us and save us, for he is good and the friend of man. Let the mercy of the Lord be upon us according as we have hoped in thee. 
the sacred monastery and of all of our fathers and bring on to the rest before us. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. <laughs> we search for thee in prayer, O Lord. For all is comprehended in thee. May we be enriched by thee, for thou art wealth, which diminishes, which diminishes not with the changes of time. May thy loving kindness come to our aid. May thy grace defend us. From thy treasury pour out upon us restoration to heal our souls. We must seek thee above all else, and not seek anything else but thee, for he who seeks thee finds all in thee. In thee is wealth for the needy, heartfelt joy for the sorrowing, restoration for all the wounded, consolation for all who mourn. Accept our prayer, O Lord, and grant us thyself. May we live in thee, may we possess thee instead of all else, for then all is ours. Grant, O Lord, that we may be thine, and according to thy loving kindness be thou ours. For the righteous Father gave us thee for the healing of our souls, for the healing of our sores. Thou art ours according to the will of thy Father, and thou art ours according to thine own desire. Thou art with us, O Emmanuel, thou art with us as our Lord. Accept these prayers from us, O our God, who has descended to us. Accept the tears of sinners, and show mercy to the guilty. According to thy desire, thou hast been united with us. Be the intercessor of our prayer. Raise it up to thy Father and establish peace in our souls. I bow down before thee, O Master. I bless thee, O good one. I beseech thee, O Holy One. I fall down before thee, O lover of mankind. I glorify thee, O Christ, for thou art, for thou, O only begotten, Master of all, O only sinless one, was for the sake of me, an unworthy sinner, given up to death on the cross, in order to free the soul of a sinner from the bondage of sin. And how shall I repay thee, O Master? Glory to Thee, O lover of mankind. Glory to Thee, O merciful one. Glory to Thee, O long-suffering one. Glory to Thee, who forgivest every man into sin, who forgivest every fall into sin. Glory to Thee, who didst descend to save our souls. Glory to Thee, who didst take flesh in the womb of the Virgin. Glory to Thee, who didst suffer bondage. Glory to Thee, who didst accept scourging. Glory to Thee, who hast who was made an object of humiliation. Glory to Thee, who was crucified. Glory to Thee, who was buried. Glory to thee who didst rise from the dead. Glory to thee of whom the prophets spoke. Glory to thee in whom we have believed. Glory to thee who didst ascended to heaven. Glory to thee who didst sit with glory at the right hand of the Father and who art coming again with hosts of angels to judge every soul that has scorned thy holy passion. In that dreadful and anxious hour when the heavenly powers are roused, when all the angels, archangels, seraphim, and cherubim will stand with fear and trembling before thy glory, when the foundations of the earth shall be shaken, and when all that breathes will be terrified by the incom incomparable greatness of thy glory. In that hour mayest thou take me under thy wing, and may my soul be delivered from the terrible fire and from the gnashing of teeth, from utter darkness and from eternal lamentation, that I may bless thee and say, Glory to him who has desired to save a sinner according to the great compassion of his mercy. To the voice of the Lord Jesus, our Chief Shepherd Christ, let us hearken, all ye that have ever sinned in life. For our sakes he hath appeared in the flesh on earth, and doth call unto repentance all those that have transgressed, saying, Take courage and fear not, for though the labor be bitter, Yet sweet in truth is the recompense. The prayers of Holy Fathers, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us and save us. The prayers of our Holy Master, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us and save us. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. 
Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me.